Okay. Hello. Hi. Let's do it. Let's do it. I'm so tired, y'all, but we're almost there. We're almost done. I'm not like, I'm not like tired, tired. I'm actually pretty awake. I had a pretty good day. Um, you know, it's just a lot of, we've done a lot of demos this week. And we still have more to go, but we can do it. Let me pull up the game. Uh, and then I'll switch over and I'll talk about it. And then we'll play it. Oh, it's actually a nice volume. Okay. Let me switch over. It's probably a little low, actually. Okay. Hi! How's it going? Hope you're having a good one. Hope you're having a good weekend. Thank you for joining me again for Steam Next Fest demos. Today we're playing quite a few, but we're starting with Super Battle Automat. I did it again. Super Auto Battlemon. It is a monster taming auto battler with roguelike elements. Fight, collect, upgrade, and evolve Battlemon to build your ultimate team. Discover different synergies to unleash wicked combos on powerful bosses. Over a hundred plus battlemen to catch and build your dream team with. Yeah! So here's the here's the link for it if I spell right. Oh, let me pin this. Alright, and let's try it out. God, it starts with the music low. I love it. I'm actually gonna turn it up just a little. Alright, let's try it out. Welcome to the world of Super Auto Battlemon! If you need help, there's some info. Alright, are these who I have or are these who I pick? Click to select. Okay, so there's Kreeze. Grants 100 shield to front ally. Gains 10 region and taunt. Gains 2 fast and 1 multi strike. Yeah, I gotta pick a starter! Okay, I'm really liking Monku though. I gotta, I gotta pick you. Uh, what have I done? What have I done? Uh, do I pick your typing? Or is this where I start? Okay, I think this is how I start. Hmm. There we go. Start battle. Okay, okay. So yeah, it's an auto battler. Let's go. Let's go, Monku. You got it. Let's go, Knock. I didn't know I had you. What does the scissors do? Oh. I know! Look at him go! Uh, I think we just got one. Tadmire? Oh, okay, okay. I see. Get your Knock stand. <laughs> Grass Air. Okay. Uh, what do these do? Okay, that's, uh... Battle decks. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. Okay. Can I, like, move your position? What did that do? <laughs> uh, it just spins you around. Okay. Let's go. Knock! Knock, be careful! Knock, be careful! Oh my god. Oh my god. Knock, please be careful. Woo! Okay. Do I want peeling or doot? Peeling gains... Uh, grants the ally five fast in front. And gains bonus speed. Uh, Doot deals 300 damage to the- We're gonna take you, Doot. Let's go. Uh, let's see. Hmm. I kind of want to see what the special events are, so we're gonna rest. We're gonna take a little rest. Um... Do I want them to gain 30 XP or gain a lightning type? A lightning type might be good. Oh, drag a bottom on into the slot. Okay, um, let's see. Let's give you lightning. Uh, because you're kind of a common type, so you could use something fun and cool. Um, you're my baby. 
So you're going to get 30 XP. Yeah, there we go. Uh, Let's do this one. Snorb Showdown. You hear a loud noise coming from somewhere nearby. After following the noise, you come across a clearing full of Snorbs playing and fighting with each other. Uh, if I learn... I grant an ally 30 XP if I watch. I select the unit to gain grass type. Uh, or they either get gas, grass or ice. Okay. Um, let's give it to you. Because I think no matter what, you're getting something new. Oh, well you, okay, you get a grass type. Yeah, go ahead, buddy. Uh, we'll go here. Okay, good. I put knocked behind, behind Monku. Oh, thank God. All right, let's go. Oh, Monku, you don't have a lot of health, huh? Oh no! Oh, Monku got knocked out. But it's okay. Dude, let's do it. Yeah, dude! Oh, I'm so worried. I'm so worried. Knocked, please. We need you alive. We love you. Woo! Okay. Oh, man. Man, that was scary. That was scary. Okay. Uh... Whisper targets the lowest enemy health. Uh, ooh. That might be good. You're also rare. Oh, but healing. Oh. No, I'm gonna take you. You're rare. You're cool. All right. Oh, hold on. Um. Let me take out Tadmire for Whisper, and let's see how that goes. Ah. Uh, does that mean that you have? Um. Oh. Oh, I got bad matchups. That's what it is. Uh. No, I got good. They can all. Okay, okay. I think I see. I think I get it. Jeez. Jeez. Y'all regenin' over there? No thank you. No thank you. Here we go. Alright. Alright. This is a good team. Alright. We're doing a coordinated attack. Let's go. Ooh. Poison. Okay. Um. You heal. You shield. You decay. Ooh. And you decay to all enemies. You decay to the highest level. Um. Hmm. Oh, but this was a snake. I have to. I'm a snake. Um. There you go. This way. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh. I don't think I want someone to get in lightning type. I think I'm good with you having lightning. Um. <coughs> Excuse me. There you go. Uh, let's go to a random event. Uh, you see a yellow blur swiftly buzzing about in the distance. On closer inspection, a lone beetling is, tra is training in the woods. Okay. Let's sneak. Yeah! Okay. Um. Let's give this to you since you're in the front. Alright. Let. Oh, we got a lot of fighting coming up. Okay. Let's fight. 
Oh, y'all have a snake friend too. I'm gonna keep you down here though, okay? Ah, it's okay. Oh, oh, is it okay? Hmm. Come on, you got it. Y'all gotta protect Monku. Oh my god, Monku, you're not gonna make it out of this. Oh, Monku, you're not gonna make it out of this. Uh, can I put someone else in? Is that possible? No, that's not possible. Alright, good job, guys. Good job. Knock! Knock, be careful! Oh my god, Knock is not being careful. Oh, there Knock goes. Oh, that decay is really... Ooh, 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 I barely... Barely, okay. Um... Yeah, I'll get more XP for you. Did you... Did you evolve? I think it evolved. It did. Um. Okay, knock. I'm gonna take you out. I'm gonna put Snimes in. We're gonna see how it goes. Woo! Ow! Ow. Oh my god! Ah, uh, we may not win. Oh my god, we may not win. We might lose. Wow. Woo! Oh, come on, do your best, Snimea. Snimea and Whisper, do your best. The decay will help. I know it. I really need a healer. I have one, I just have to put them in. Oh. Oh, wow. Oh. Oh my god! Oh, wow! Okay. Wow. Whisper with the- with the clutch. The clutch save. Oh my god. Uh, ooh. That might be really good. Yeah, let's do that. Um, okay, so I need... Monku, I'm going to put you down. I'm going to put Barry in. Because I'm thinking that's going to be good. The decay is good. The extra fail is good. Um... Do hmm. Dude, I'm gonna force Tad Meyer in and see how that goes. Let's see how that goes. Ooh, this game is good. <laughs> Can y'all stop decaying me so much? What the fuck? Oh, you know, I don't know if Whisper works well with Snimea. Oh no, it still goes. It still goes well. Okay. Oh, there Barry goes. Okay, okay. Try your best. Try your best. Oh. Okay. Okay. Ooh, ooh. Woo! Okay, that worked. That worked out well. Um. Ooh, that 50 strength might be really good, but... I'm gonna level up sn uh, Snows some more. Uh, alright. <laughs> We're getting close. Okay. Barry... Do your best. Oh, they have a they have an evolved berry. Oh no. A Tedum. Maybe I need to go back and grind. Oh, try your best, try your best. Oh. What was that? I didn't have a shadow. 
Oh, we gotta take that guy out. We gotta take that guy out. Come on, get the Tedum. Oh. Oh, there he goes. Okay. Try your best. Woo! Okay, okay, we got we got him out. Oh, you're close. Oh, what is that? That's weird. Ah, okay. That's fine. Oh, Tadmire, you got it. You got it, Tadmire. Let's go, let's go. Oh, no. Oh, Tadmire. Oh, no. Oh, oh, you might be okay. You might be okay. No, you're not okay. Okay, that's not too bad, though. Um... Fairy, I need you to get... Okay, there you go. There's your level up. We need a random event. Ooh. Um. Sneak. Woo! Uh. You will start with 20 regen. Because you're kind of our... You're our big guy. Uh, hmm. Okay, let's do the air grass. Let's go. Man. Oh my god. My healer is almost dead. Please. Leave him alone. Okay. This one might be a little easier on me, though. Tadam's doing great. Tadam is really helping out here. Tadmire's even doing well. I'm not sure what the purple uh, status here is, but... I don't know. Tadmire's doing it. Oh, you revive. Okay, okay. Woo! Um. Tadmire, you need more XP. Ooh, you leveled up. You're a shrivet now. Um, let's see. I need you to gain 30 XP. I need you to level up. Um. I don't know if I want you to have ice type. Uh, let's give you an ice type then. This game is called Super Auto Battle Mon. It's a uh, it's an auto battler. It's actually pretty cool. So these are my beautiful Pokemon, uh, Battle Mon, Tedum who uh, gives all of my allies extra punch and charge. Um, there's Snymia, who deals decay to the enemies. Uh, there's Gatapot, who targets the lowest health enemy for eight attacks and forces all my allies to hit them. And then there's Shribbit, who grants uh, healing and shield. And we're fighting a bunch of... A bunch of knocked level ups, it looks like. What do you mean, epic? Oh, okay, okay. Oh, that's okay. We'll win. We'll win. I know it. I know we'll win. I hope we'll win. I don't know. I'm a little worried. I know we just started, but I'm a little worried. Has like AFK Arena vibes. Okay, that's fair. I haven't played it, but I believe you. Okay. Oh, so y'all just automatically go and heal that one. Okay. Well, I don't want y'all to heal your guy. What are y'all? Oh. Oh, Tedum, you gotta stay alive. You're charging the party. 
Oh, you about to go. All right. You're still alive for a little bit, though. Oh, no. There you go. Woo! Okay. I got three people on the boss. That's not bad. I got two people on the boss. That's not bad. Oh, I ain't gonna beat this boss. I ain't gonna beat this boss. Oh, there it goes. Oh! I died. Okay, let's try again. I think... I think it's a rogue... I don't know if I keep what I... No, I don't. I don't. Okay. That's wild, though. That boss was hard. Okay, I'm not gonna do it again because I have a lot of games to go through, but... <laughs> This is Battle Super Battle Automon. Um, it's actually pretty cool. I really think it's pretty neat. Uh, there's a lot of... There's a lot I wish I learned a little more about, but... I mean, it's pretty... It says what they do, so like, if you read, you know what you're doing. <laughs> um, oh, there's also a list of status effects and what they do. Okay, that's that's great. Yeah, so if you like this type of game, it's very good. It's very fun. Um, I will have to tell my friend that, no, this is not what Pokemon is, but, <laughs> but it's fun. Um, okay. I feel like you should let me get out of it before I do this, but yeah, that's fine. I could just go do it later, but... I get it. But now I have to si now I have to hit no. <laughs> anyway, um let me do this for timestamp purposes as I pick up the next game that is on my demo list. Um and that's going to be I think it's Fake Heart. Yes. Next on our list is Fake Heart demo. Let me bring that up. Fake Heart is an interactive visual novel game about an episode between an elderly fairy tale writer, Jade, and granddaughter, Sarah. So let me put that in. Oops. There we go. So let me put that in. Uh, I also have to manually adjust the sound, so give me a sec, because it's really loud. <laughs> oh, fuck. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Fuck. Okay. We're gonna have to deal with the sound, because it goes straight into, like, a, a video. So, <sighs> you'll be fine, because I have it set so that way it doesn't go past a certain, uh, volume, but... My ears... <laughs> All right. So it, to me, it's really loud, but I can't do anything about it. Ugh. There we go. I think this is the, uh, the fairy tale novelist grand parent why is there nowhere to set the volume setting please volume setting please <laughs> make that the number one thing that you do in your demo the Cheshire cat is getting ready for a trip looking for the Mad Hatter's lost hat oh okay those are the loading uh the loading screen flavor text. That's actually pretty cute. Empathizing with the mock turtle sorrow. The white rabbit is dreaming of a summer ocean. Waking up Alice. There is always an order to what is important. A limited amount of time is not enough to consider all your options. Sometimes you make the wrong choice, but what about it? Taking responsibility is part of everyone's life. However, as life goes on, Sometimes big things happen that you aren't responsible for. 
Oh, I guess there's different chapters. I don't like that I'm able to see that before I finish the previous. I feel like I'm spoiling myself. <laughs> New music obtained. Thanks, I didn't do anything, but thank you. Press escape to open the menu. Oh, game option. Oh. Press spacebar or mouse to flip the subtitles. If you press and hold the spacebar, it passes quickly. Hold on. Why did I have to get this far in to fix the volume? Oh, man. Okay, that should be better. I wish... I know that there's only so much you can do when you're a dev and when you're trying to get your demo out, but I wish they would prioritize sound a little more. Because especially if you're playing with, like, headsets, it's so hard. I like that you can make the subtitles big, though. I'm gonna make it large. I don't recognize the person in the mirror. My broken heart eventually became too cold. While I might start to find myself again, no one will recognize me. I'm forever locked away in an endless dark space. There's a saying. If you can't love yourself, you can't love others. I'm gonna move the cursor out of the way. Jade looked at the charred bookshelf. The ruined papers and stale scent contained his old life full of struggle and strife. Jade knew better than anyone else. Perhaps these weren't just papers, but a metaphor for his life itself. He thought the records of his life were precious memories that he always- that he would always be able to tell Donna. Hi, how are you today, Ronnie? Happy Saturday! Hope you're having a good Saturday. You came just in time not to have your ears blasted off by this demo. But now he was only embarrassed. Frustration ate at him and tore up his stomach. It felt as though his eyes, nose, ears, and even lips were blocked, making him unable to take a proper breath. Jade ripped the notebook. One page, two pages. It didn't take long for all the memories from Jade's life to be ripped from the bookshelf altogether. Ripped white pieces of paper littered the floor, like he was standing in a new world covered in a layer of snow. He laughed pitifully. What was so precious about all of this? He picked up a handful of ripped pieces and threw them. They fluttered around like snowflakes. Soon, a bitter cold crept creeped in. He could no longer write fairy tales that made children happy. The remaining record of his life had long been burned up in the fire. His head throbbed. He shakily grabbed the medicine container on the desk. The strongest pills were located on the right side. He managed to swallow the pill with a sip of water. He couldn't help but laugh at how pathetic he was. He began to cry at the same time. Jade lifted the half-drank bottle of 50-proof vodka. Before his eyes, he saw Sarah sli softly sleeping. Who had scribbled over that child's beautiful face? Is that scribble? Yeah, I guess so. I really like the artwork in this game. Jade knew well. I'm the one who scribbled over that girl's life face, and memories. I did it in bad order, sorry. Jade continued to cry. I'm the one who scribbled over that girl's face, life, and memories. Jade began to tremble. I'm the one who scribbled over that girl's face, life, and memories. Jade wanted to die, but he couldn't, because living in a tone life wasn't enough. Jade spilled a handful of emotions that had nothing to do with his will into those tears. The anger at himself, the guilt of the past. Maybe it was the alcohol talking. But if she hadn't stopped him, if she hadn't have stopped him then, would it have made a difference? It's not possible to know if the last luxury you first enjoy on the last day of your sad life will lead you and the people you love to an unhappy future. Life is just like that. Happy people continue to be happy. Sad people continue to be sad. They find you numerous times like old friends. Today's story is like the story of a cicada's life. What kind of ending awaits those who continue to endure their meaningless lives? 
even when their futures are predetermined to be extremely painful. What kind of responses will you give at the end of the story? It is my hope that you will reveal your choice at the end of the story. Jade could no longer overcome his overwhelming fatigue and fell asleep. The last thing he saw was the empty vodka bottle, rolling a little further away from him. The bottles of alcohol he drank eased the pain a little, and now he had enough to line a whole wall. To him, the world was full of meaningless noise, and every day of his continuing life was torture. Once the blinding sun hit the empty bottle and woke him, he ventured into town, played some cards, and drank late into the night. It's funny how someone's life has the same value as a small poker chip. It was ironic that the only place Jade felt alive was playing cards at that small poker table that had ruined the lives of countless others. In those moments when he drank, until he blacked out and played cards with others, he could at least breathe, but the overwhelming weight of his pain and guilt holding him down. The godfather of fairy tale writers continued to spiral. And much later, the girl who was filled with so much warmth and kindness came to hate her grandfather. I don't recognize the person in the mirror. My broken heart eventually became too cold. We may start moving towards our future, but no one will know. We'll be forever stuck in that endless dark place. There's a saying, if you can't love yourself, you can't love others. Okay, so this feels like, uh... I wouldn't say exactly comic. It feels like, um... It's like a light novel, almost. Jade told Sarah everything he had done on the day of the incident, including what he had heard from Georgie. A strange mix of guilt and subtle relief flooded him. Although usually cheerful and confident, Sarah couldn't hide her faint trembling that day. They call it an interactive, like, novel. But I haven't really been able to interact yet. An interactive visual novel. But, um... I'm just reading. It was a very snowy day. The newspaper said it was the worst snowfall in 40 years. The snow had been falling heavily since early morning, and piled up to my feet so quickly. I also remember that it was overcrowded with patients, of course. I worked an extra three hours after I was supposed to be off the clock. By the time the first early morning wave of patients left, it was already late afternoon. I was exhausted from working without eating lunch. After my overtime finished, I went out to the back of the hospital and smoked a cigarette. The bench was full of snow, so I had to rest against a tree. On a day like this, I'd usually go home, or a day like that, I'd usually go home and have a glass of bourbon, but the snow was continuing down heavily and basically forced me to stay at the hospital. It was a hell of a day. It was right when I was in the middle of a heavy sigh. When Georgie's cigarette was half done, there was a loud noise from the hospital. He was hoping it wasn't what he thought it was, but he heard his name shouted a few times inside. Ellen, a nurse who had been working with him for ten years, came up to him, panting for breath. Breath. Doctor, there you are. I'm really sorry, but I need you to come with me. A man was rushed in with his family. He's unconscious and severely burned. Instead of answering, Georgie took another puff of his cigarette. Doctor! My shift is over. I know, but if you don't go, the patient will be in danger. You're the only left on call at the hospital today, Dr. Georgie. I know. I worked plenty of overtime today. I couldn't even eat lunch. I'd do it for the money, but I don't know. Can you really just ignore a precious life? Oh, can you really just ignore a precious life? Precious life? I guess that's true. At least when I'm a doctor. But right now I'm just an ordinary guy smoking my cigarette and cursing this white shit all over. Georgie didn't want to work another second today. His muscles were tight from stiffness, and his now dried up gown was uncomfortable. Even if he couldn't go home, he wanted to wash up and finish his day. But at Ellie's continued protests, Georgie was forced to say yes. He stamped out the remainder of his cigarette and headed into the hospital.
I don't know if I should say this, but honestly, I don't really care much about my job. I was just trying to make a living. You don't know how doctors are viewed here, do you, Jade? Even in these small suburbs, little kids call me a quack. What does that even mean? Since the nurse I worked with forever asked, I decided to go see for myself. Ooh. There was an old car parked in front of the hospital. Inside, all the people who appeared to be his family were all passed out. The man spoke to me, his charred clothes and wounded hands shaking. My daughter. It's my daughter. Please save my little girl. This is my dad and wife. They'll be okay, right? Please help us, doctor. First, can you tell me what happened? I need to know the cause so I can work quickly. I don't know the details myself. The house was already on fire when I got home. Please. I came as fast as I could. They'll be okay, right? Please save them. Please, I'm begging. I'll do my best. Ellen, call the rest of the nurses and take the little girl into the hospital. What's your name, sir? Me? I'm, I'm Hein. Alright, Hein. I'll grab a stretcher, so can you help me move that big guy inside? It looked like you need help too, but there's no one else here right now. Yeah, okay. Please work as fast as you can. I don't need help. Oh, I don't need help. Just please save my family. Okay, this is one thing that I'd point out. Um, I don't know if there's always, like, conversations between two people, but I really need them to, like, kind of distinguish it just a little bit. Because it, sometimes it's kind of hard to tell who's talking. <laughs> they aren't dead yet, so stop telling me to save them. As you can see, I'm not a strong person. I'm merely a professional. I had trouble moving you inside, Jade. Even though he was hurt, Hines still helped, and we got you inside. My gown was getting drenched with sweat again, which stunk, but... I finished my second straight shift with no problems. After I finished, I went back to Hein and explained the situation. The right side of the child's face was exposed to high heat. It's a good thing you came quickly. She'll have a scar, but there won't be any issues. I think someone gave her first aid on the way that here. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, thank God. Thank God, really. The big guy broke his arm. and so Oh wait, the big guy broke his arm and several of his ribs were cracked. His body is so big that he probably got hurt in the fall. It might take a while for him to wake up, but there should be no issues. I believe the woman inhaled some hot smoke, but it won't be a problem. Does that mean they're okay? Yes, I think so. Yeah, very, Sag. When he heard everything would be okay, Heinz sat down and repeated thank you over and over. Ah, oh, ah, uh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you, thank you so much. I should take a look at you now. You're the last one left to look at. Oh, I'm fine. I'm feeling better now that everything seems okay. I'm feeling a bit tired, so I'll get some rest. I don't know if you're getting back up, buddy. Thank you so much. Well, all right. The nurses are on standby, so if you feel weird, let them know. Thank you for your concern. I'll just get some shut-eye. When I came back to check on him, he was asleep against the wall, clinging to his daughter's hand. We found this out later, but his condition was the worst out of all of you. He inhaled too much hot smoke and overworked his body for too long. I worked in this town for over 20 years now, but I don't know how the hell he held on in that condition. He must have been in terrible pain every time he took a breath. I don't know how he looked so happy to hold his daughter's hand. I still don't get it. There's nothing I can say if you want to curse me out, Jade. But I can't do anything to help if the patient refuses care. <sighs> Jade frowned and placed his hand on his head. He had an awful headache that wasn't caused by the accident. I want to be alone. Uh, I'm sorry for kicking you out after asking you for you to talk. Okay, just for a bit. But let me say this first. I'm not usually supposed to tell you this, but... Georgie sat there and recited the whole story, but none of it stayed in Jade's mind. I'm really sorry. I don't know if it's because I'm confused. Oh, I don't know if it's because I'm confused, but I don't understand a word you're saying. It's like you're speaking a different language. Like a different language. Okay, I'll take my leave. 
After that, Jade didn't see Dr. Georgie again. What Jade didn't know was that Georgie quit being a doctor because the foundation of his beliefs were so shaken. He didn't know why he suddenly had changed when he had no attachment to his job before. Jade told Sarah everything he heard from Georgie, as well as what he had done on the day of the fire, all without hiding anything. After finishing his story, Jade let out a deep, quiet breath. A quiet, deep breath. <laughs> he felt a strange mix of guilt and a small bit of relief. Sarah was completely still after hearing the whole story. For a moment, Jade thought he had told a difficult story for no reason at all. Although she had to mature from a young age, Sarah was still just a little girl. He couldn't bear to look her in the eyes. Instead, Jade bit his lip and looked up to the sky. Sadly, it was a beautiful sunny day. After a while, Sarah finally spoke. My dad was a good person until the end. He was an idiot like you said, Grandpa. Jade wanted to say something, but nothing left his trembling lips. To other people, to me, and even to you, Grandpa, he was a great person. I'm sorry. I'm sorry for being so selfish, Sarah. Grandpa, it must have been hard for you to tell me. Thank you. I feel a little better now. I don't remember anything. I thought that Dad had done something wrong. I was a bad person because he didn't tell me anything. Hee <laughs> hee. Thank God. I'm glad my dad was such a good person. Sarah's words were happy and confident, but Jade could feel her shaking. Jade held on to Sarah for a very long time. Sarah's back was full of small, wet streaks of tears. A bit later, Sarah finally sprang up. Jade stared at her dumbfounded without saying anything. Sarah took a breath and yelled in a loud voice. Dad, I heard everything from Grandpa. You're a good person, Dad. I know that now. And now I know where you are, so I'll come back often and tell you about my life. It was a bit late, but Sarah could finally give Hein a proper goodbye at the end of that spring. Two months later. A soft humming came from the two-story house at the northwest end of Jaichi village. The voice was heavy with what could only be described as sadness and nostalgia. Ever since he told Sarah everything, they had become closer than ever. These days, wherever they went, for a walk, he and Sarah stopped by the graves to talk, almost like a routine. Jade thought she would hate and resent him, but Sarah seemed to forgive and understand him. A bit later, lyrics could be heard. I'm not going to sing this. I hope it snows this spring so the withered canola flowers get buried. I hope it snows. Snow in March. After bringing spring, it was the first song she played for him. It was a good song that he liked. He had liked from when he had black hair until now. When she first sang the song for him, Jade saw beautiful lights dancing around her, glittering more vividly than any jewel. Splendor. What Jade felt that day was the word itself. She always sang for him, and every time he felt a fatigue wash over him like, a, like sunshine in a bottle. He always would fall asleep in her lap. To him, the song was more than lyrics and rhyming lines. It was her strong scent drilling deep into him. With that meaning, he wanted to sing a song for Dana. Hi, Beetle! Welcome! We're playing an interactive visual novel. I don't know where I interact. <laughs> I don't think I could interact. But we're reading a visual novel. Who gave him the biggest happiness in the world. But Jade was good at nothing except for writing and hard labor. But at the same time, he had just begun honest work. So he always promised next time focusing on making enough money. But next time never came and Jade became a stage without an audience. It is very pretty art. I don't understand why the- Oh, wait, hold on. Here's the interactive. Here's the interactive. We did it. <laughs> it's interactive because it causes tears. <laughs> I did it. I did it. Uh, A, A. I don't know how to play. I don't know how to play. <laughs> yeah, I'm tuning. I guess I'm trying to get to C.
Or B? Or A? Oh, okay, there we go. Oh, sad. Aw. Shark! Uh, oh, I know what a flute looks like. I got this. I got this. This is actually a really nicely rendered flute. This is beautiful. Yeah, my orchestra days are paying off. This is pretty. Jang sang for, sang for decades until now, following her faint voice in his memory. If she heard the song, would she be moved or shed shimmering tears? Would she be able to feel the same electric happiness he felt? Jade carefully painted a picture of her. A melancholy smile, one filled with faint happiness and not sadness, lifted the corner of his lips. He now had a habit of humming this song whenever something good happened. And this week, that good day came. The train station he visited was full with yellow hydra hydragias. Hydrangeas. Hydragias. <laughs> the flowers in full bloom brought summer to life, but the murky smoke coming from the trains gave it a different feel. The streets were completely buzzing with people and made him desperate to go home. Jade looked at the gray metal watch on his left wrist. There was an hour left until the train left. Since he had free time for the first time in a while, Hydrageons, <laughs> his eyes landed on the Mogu Mogu selling cross from the river. Jade opened the door and carefully went in. The decorations above the door clanged as he stepped inside. Welcome! Please wait a moment. Jade closed his eyes, nodded once, then looked around. There were only three chairs, and the small shop was run by one hairstylist. On the left wall, there was a window where you could look outside. Small flower pots filled the flowers, lined the small shelf just below the window. Next to the customer waiting sofa was a little shelf with a variety of newspapers in it. Sorry for the wait, you could take the first seat. Yeah, the BGM is really pretty. Jade sat down. His middle-aged bushy beard and messily brushed hair showed how busy he had been over the years. How would you like it cut? As he was staring at himself in the mirror, the stylist carefully spoke to him. My hair has gotten long, so maybe trim it a little bit. How much should I cut off? I don't know enough to talk about numbers. As long as I'm not bald, you can cut as much as you want. Hmm, that's a difficult request, but I'll do my best. What do you think? I cut a lot for a lighter feel, so can you look in the mirror and see how you like it? After his hair was dry, he sat down again. There wasn't a big difference, but he felt lighter and more refreshed. This is good. Thank you. Great. Good work. Then shall we move on to the next story? Oh, was that to me? <laughs> Uh, how would I describe the story so far? Uh, well, this guy, uh, he's, um, he's like a fairy tale writer, novelist, but he seems to have kind of lost his spark. Uh, we came into him, like, 
drinking, upset, his uh, granddaughter hating him. Uh, chapter two was um, learning about the incident. We learn it from the perspective of the doctor who um, apparently there was a house fire and uh, the, uh, the man's uh, son bought him and his wife and uh, the daughter, so our main guy's granddaughter, because there had been a house fire, and um, apparently everyone was okay except for the dad who had inhaled the most smoke of all, so he died, and our grandfather told the granddaughter and um, she, you know, forgave him, and, um, then we learned, I guess, a little bit of his past. That's about what we learned. This was actually the first interactive section in Chapter 2, so I thought that was neat. Because I was like, man, this is an extra long chapter, why? And then I saw the in- I was also like, this is an interactive visual novel. Where does the interactive part come in? And then it heard me, and it was like, here it is. And I was like, oh, okay. So now we're on chapter three. And this is kind of the last chapter in the demo. Uh, Jade thought he forgot everything, but the memory still lived on, occasionally popping up in his mind to torment him. He saw ice cream clouds and empty benches as his world turned upside down. But Del Brenu's hysterical laughter was enough to keep Jade from spiraling into the abyss. All right, let's go in. Why can't I? <sighs> really? I've told you a bunch of times. You can't because you can't. Oh, thank you for the head pads. Why are the normal looking guys the most stubborn? What's the problem? It's so bright outside. Tisk tisk. This is why I have issues with you land people. Ocean weather isn't just what you can see. See that out there? Even though it doesn't look like much, all those white things are waves. And it looks like it'll get windy soon. If something happened while you were out there, are you going to take responsibility? <sighs> then how long do I have to wait? How should I know? The skies decide. Sarah watched the people while eating her ice cream, noticing that something seemed to be wrong. She couldn't hear well because it was far, but the noisy exchange kept coming and going. Sitting on the bench in the shade, Sarah swung her feet back and forth. Cute, Sarah. A new message has arrived. Sarah, wipe your drool. Oh, a little kitty. Look at this cat! <laughs> Grandpa, what is it? Where are you? I'm going to eat all the ice cream if you don't hurry. Press and send a message. Ah, sorry. Hey, hey, Grandpa! Today was super fun, wasn't it? What do you wish for when you let the lantern go? What did you wish for when you let the lantern go? Oh, thank you for patting, Tiger. Yeah, I get those pats, buddy. Yeah, it was really fun. Huh? Uh, I wish for your happiness, Sarah. I only have one wish. For you to be happy, Sarah. Oh, then why did that? Okay. So that's what you wished for. So that's what you wished for. I guess. Wow, really? You're the best, Grandpa. I love this. I want this. I think that wish already came true. I'm really happy right now. I'm happy to hear it. But Sarah... Yeah? A small problem came up. It's a problem I have to fix before we can go home together. Can you just wait a bit? Sure. Duh. I'll wait at the place we were at before. Thanks. It's hot today, so sit in the shade. I'll be there soon. Something must be wrong. I guess life's not always easy. Nom nom. This ice cream is super delicious. Eating ice cream reminded her of her previous night, of the previous night. Yo, that's cute. All oh, that's cute. Sarah began to remember all the scenes from her memory. Grandma Griffin with the kind face, Hazel's sister with a nice heart, one of the most delicious dishes she had ever eaten. 
A memory's letter to the question. Would Hazel's sister make good ice cream too? Just that moment, thanks to the hot sun, her ice cream dripped down and fell to the ground. Ack! Aw, oh, too bad. Ugh, now my hands are all sticky. Sarah looked underneath at the bench while sitting. In the upside-down world, her dropped ice cream looked like fluffy clouds, and a small cat was walking backwards a little further away. Oh! Hazel? Hazel, why are you here? Anyway, the boats won't be going out today. The ticket agent slammed the door shut with his snappy remark. All the festival growers crowded around the port. Everyone looked confused at the current predicament. Jade took a seat next to the closed ticket's office and hung his head. It was true that the ticket agent had lived in the area much longer and knew the weather, but it was also true he was stuck on this island now. Jade muttered to himself, a cigarette hanging from his lips. Ah, <sighs> people are probably angry. Oh wait, people are probably angry, someone suddenly spoke to him. What? <laughs> Jade? Is that you, Jade? Jade swallowed the sigh that threatened to escape. He took out the cigarette from his mouth to answer. Yes, hello. Have we met before? Ha! Ah, is that really you? You've changed so much. Your black hair is completely white. All well, the color is gone. Ha ha ha! Do I know you? Behind the old man was a group of men in black suits. They were scattered around here and there, but there would be about ten of them that looked the same. I should say sorry first. I'm not used to your face, sir. Would you please explain where we've met before? Sir? Please explain. Are you really the jade I once knew? <laughs> Maybe I mistook you for someone else. Oh, how sad. Shouldn't you remember the faces of your family? Then what's the point of calling it a family? Ah, speaking of, is that lady in white still alive? Jade jumped to his feet as soon as he heard the last line. The men in black suits all surrounded him. The man smiled and made them off like it was okay. Jade and this man were about... Two... Two inches? Two inches? Give me two feet! I think two feet! <laughs> You're still so short. I thought you had gotten taller. Sorry, but I have something I need to do. I'll leave first. All the guys who wore ripped scraps of cloth, the smaller ones I used to beat up in the alley, are now all gentlemen. They're overflowing with charm, ha ha ha. Jade could finally figure out where he knew this man from his peculiar way of speech. Delbri knew. I have nothing left to say about back then. Haha, <laughs> so you finally remember me. I was disappointed because I thought you forgot. I realized what I did was morally wrong. When I die, I'll pay for all my sins. Uh, I don't know who's saying that. Let's head our separate ways. Huh? Hmm, fine. That's up to you, though. Del Brunu's lips quirked up on one side, and he took a cigarette case from his pocket. The sleek gold case twinkle twinkled in the sunlight. He put a cigarette in his mouth, snapped his fingers, and a man in a black suit took out a lighter and lit it. You need a light? No, I'm good. Jade, there's no right or wrong in this world. There are only two things. Black and white. Orders, rules, all bullshit. You know too. Power is the best thing to have. Haha, <laughs> who cares about ethics? Those are lines that comedians learn and use. I'm glad you think I'm funny. I've been stressed because I haven't written well lately. I'm like guessing. Anyway, I have nothing left to say, so I'll go. Let's not meet each other again. I think that was... I think that was him. Not him, but I think that was our boy. Uh, oh, you're still so blunt. Why is your response to my warm greeting so cold? We should at least have a drink together. It's been a long time since we've met. Ha ha ha. Alcohol is bad for you. Someday you'll come find me again. Jade pushed past the black suits and left. He thought Del Brino, uh, Brinu, 
Might try for revenge as he left, but luckily Delbrinu only laughed and left him alone. Jade headed towards the bench where Sarah was. Ice cream had fallen to the ground, but not melted completely. It was Sarah's ice cream. Sarah? Jade's voice grew louder as he called for her. Sarah, where are you? But there was no answer. Jade thought his voice might be drowned out by the crowd. He called out for her with a louder voice. Sarah! If you can hear me, answer me! But there was still no answer. People looked at Jade with surprise from how loud he was. For a moment, Jade felt the ground shift from beneath his feet. At the same time, nausea churned in his stomach. Jade wavered and fell to the bench, and the world around him went black. This man pass out? Alice, who lost her way, chatted with the Joker for a while. The Joker decided to tell the story of this kingdom when a long-awaited girl suddenly appeared. Uh. Alright. Nothing the same. Nothing the same yet. Hey! World and the loose-lipped card. But the heart cried out as if it was unfair. What the heck? I did everything I could! Do you know how hard it is to survive every day in this damn world? Spade smiled as he answered. The walls have ears. They hear everything. And Spade took Hart somewhere deep and far. Hart was unable to leave the kingdom at all. I'm shipping. The clovers split up and managed the garden yet again today. They tended to the roses so they wouldn't be surprised. That's what gardeners did. The clovers, who watched over every day, felt love for the roses one day. Every time they saw them, that love grew bigger. But they couldn't just take the roses like they wanted. The roses weren't allowed to leave their areas. So the clovers decided to destroy the story. They smiled as they watched the, blurning, the burning flames. That was how a new story was made. Ah. The diamonds cleaned the castle yet again today. They swept until not a speck of dust was left, and wiped until the windows were spotless. Truthfully, they have been growing tired of their meaningless work for decades, but can it be helped? They can't make trash that doesn't exist. He uttered one phrase lowly. I'm bored. If one day, people found this card kingdom, they would be amazed at how beautiful and amazing it was, without seeing the things trapped inside of it. Is it fruitless to dream of an impossible future? The rational thing would be to adjust to the frustrating reality. The question bit its tail, but had no choice but to live. Why do the cards keep doing such boring, scary stuff? If they hate it, they can quit. The King of Cards told them to do it. The King is a bad guy, making them do work they hate. Oh, really? If you were the king, what would you do, Sarah? Hmm, if I were the king, I'd let people choose what they want to do. Because doing things you want is fun. Unlike when you're forced to do homework. Sarah stretched and sat down, looking at the completed drawing on the bench. Yahoo! Oh, you're finally done? Hee <laughs> hee, yes! Drawing is hard. Can I look at what you draw? N no, it's a secret. I'll show you later. Haha, <laughs> okay, okay. Now that you've said that, I'm even more curious. Being with you makes it more fun. I was lonely because I was alone all day. See, I knew people who liked cats were all good people. Sarah looked at Haley's t-shirt and smiled brightly. Stranger danger, who are you? Oh, good. Can I sit next to you? Um, no. Why not? Haley pouted and gave Sarah a sad look. Ah, it's not that I don't want you to, but it's sticky because I dropped my ice cream earlier. Here is fine, so sit here. Oh, thank you. Are you okay now? Yep, I feel a lot better. I don't know if it's because we talked or drew together, but my heart isn't beating as fast. I was scared because I got lost earlier, but luckily I found my way back here. 
My grandpa will come find me soon, so I'm okay. I'm jealous. It's very precious and lucky to have someone looking and waiting for you. That's right. Can you tell me now? Hmm? I told you all about my trip earlier. Do you want to hear something else? No, no. It just looks like you're worried about something. You listen to my... You listen to my cat rescue missions with Hazel and Sion. You listen to... Okay, I think maybe that was her saying that. Now it's my turn to listen. No, now it's my turn to listen. Hee <laughs> hee. Yeah, it's a really good shot. Haha, <laughs> thanks little lady. It's a bit heavy and not very fun, but I'll tell you. Sarah swung her legs as she sat on the bench. She didn't know the word sunset, but she thought the world turning red was very pretty. I think taking a look around is just as important as going forward. Dreams and goals are really great, but if everyone who welcomes me or is waiting for me leaves, it's all worthless. I realized that a bit too late. As I moved towards the end of my life, time flew by. Eventually, I became a person without an existence. So I ran away to here. Maybe I... lost my way, just like you, little lady. Haley thought of her past life and her past self. Was it necessary to write in such detail? What's the point of that question? Ah, I'm not trying to argue. I just thought, does you have to? <laughs> Even if you write down the details one by one, it doesn't mean people will know you. I didn't write it so people would know me. I did it to make a more complete, problem-free structure. A person's character is made from their memories. Now that I don't have real memories, I need something like that structure. A person's identity is a sum of complicated information. I see. In order for another world to perfectly exist, there should be no more questions. When the question and answer finish their bloody battle and the answer comes, only then will the other world be revealed to us. Having questions remain is proof that it's not perfect yet. Haha, <laughs> I mean, I'm just a researcher, so I'll do what you tell me to do. I just thought, I just hope that I get to see the finished product while I'm still alive. Does that mean you don't trust me? Ah, you're doing it again. A genius among geniuses in our field. Who would doubt Dr. Lewis Carroll? What about you? Do you like any of the characters? Well, the caterpillar looks kind of cool, right? I especially like the Cheshire Cat. Unlike me, who is stuck in this type of space, it's free to explore the world. It's, uh, there we go. Ah, then I want to be Cheshire's friend. Friend or a travel companion, wouldn't that be cool? The Cheshire Cat has no friends. Haha, <laughs> but you can make one. Also, before we get too far, uh, Lewis Carroll is the name of the dude that did um, Alice's Adventure in Wonderland and Through the Looking get Glass. Whew. You make it sound so easy. Alright then. Write a detailed report stating from that character's persona and bring me the concept of the friend. Huh? I was just saying... One team already has a hard enough time. How can I do it alone? I do it. Because you're the doctor. You have until Friday at 8 p.m. If you can't do it, you'll have to come back every weekend. It's my first weekend off in six months. If I can't make a new character, I'll make a new event. That's okay. Huh? You're saying you've lost your way before, right? Yeah, I think. Yeah, I understand. When I was younger, I lost my way a lot, but my grandpa came to find me. At first, I cried and followed my grandpa, but after a while, I realized I knew the way myself. Hee <laughs> hee, this is my first time here, so that's why I got lost. Obviously, anyone would get lost their first time. You didn't do anything wrong. Now you can move on without getting lost. Right. That was my first life, anyway. Maybe it was decided from the start. Haley looked out to the horizon for a moment. The sunset was necessarily beautiful. Peaceful. How beautiful. Too bad it'll be ruined with the storm. I know! There's so much happening! <laughs> Sarah, do you see this? Wow, this is... Hazelnut chocolate! You like it, right? Of course! First is my grandpa. Ah, wait. I like my grandpa and Hazel first. And hazelnut chocolate second. It's been a long time since I told anyone my story. It's a gift for listening to it. Ah, yeah, thank you. Ah, uh, um, one second. 
啊。Oh my god. Try your best, kid. Oh, that was me! Oh, that was me! I'm sorry, kid. <laughs> okay, hold on. I'm gonna mute my mic because I gotta press the space bar a lot. Whew! What are you doing? Here! I bet you're hungry too. You should share your food. Om nom nom. Who is saying that? Do you want to marry me? I can't. Why not? Am I not good enough? It's a secret. Haha, <laughs> I see. Tell me whenever you change your mind, okay? Hmm, I'll think about it. I bet your grandpa's waiting in the house for you to come back. Huh? How do you know my grandpa? I'm actually an all-knowing genius. Now I have to get going. It was nice to meet you, little lady. This quickly? Then wait, one second. Take this with you. Sarah quickly dug into her pocket and pulled out a small piece of paper. On the folded piece of paper was a small map that was drawn unevenly. At the very bottom, your friend Sarah was written. What is this? This is what I drew earlier from the paper and paint you gave me. This is Jaichi Village, where I live. And this is my house. Wait, is it my grandfather's house? Anyway, come visit if you have the time. I'll be waiting to see you. Sarah, you definitely have to marry me. Hee <laughs> hee. Uh, bye bye, pretty lady. I had a lot of fun today. Whenever you come to Jaichi Village, I'll give you a ton of delicious hazelnut chocolate. Oh, why did it turn minor key? Haley stared at the sunset and took a breath. The decided path is changing little by little. Is it an error caused by numerous updates in the flow of time? Or is this part of the evolution process? What do you think? Uh, fuck. I don't, I don't even know what's going on. So that's what you think. Sorry if you expected a different answer based on your choice. This isn't a story I wrote during my lifetime. Is lifetime the right word? Anyway, thanks for the advice. The diamonds are coming, so I need to go. Let's have a deeper chat later. I really need to go back to my kingdom now. I'll see you soon. Being a person is very difficult, yet easy existence. Sometimes you feel like you'll collapse because you're hurt and tired. Other times you'll start- you'll smile brightly again, just from one person's warmth and kindness. Although the sadness in my heart claims a bigger space. The warmth I felt today may keep me warm for the rest of my life. For the first time, I have someone waiting for me. Yeah, very dissonant. Is this? There's only one. This is why you can't trust the spades. Knock it off. It's been a while since I've cleaned properly. Now I'll have to sweep again. We're leaving. You guys deal with this. This is why you don't work with criminals. They're so self-centered. Spade members, pause this episode and check the situation. What? Okay, so... <coughs> what do you mean, 98%? What? <laughs> oh, I guess because of a... Uh... Yeah, my brain... I think this game is very interesting. I think it severely needs, um... Oh, I can see all the rest of the shit. That's cool. That's actually really cool. <laughs> I mean, I'm willing to get this game just to... See whatever the fuck it wants to do with me. But like... I really need it to, um, I really need them to, like, separate out the subtitles when different people are talking, because it's really hard to keep up. It's really hard to keep up. And I think that would help, like, the cohesion of the story, too. Because if you don't know who's talking and why they're talking, like, you know what I mean? Uh, give me one second. I'm going to take my medicine.
Um, and I'm going to pull up the next game. I actually really like this. This is coming out Q1. Okay, I really need to give them feedback. Okay. <laughs> um, I'm going to change my BRB screen for timestamp purposes. I'm going to take my medicine real quick. It's just right over, like, in the back. And then I'll pull up the next game, which is 1000X Resist. And we'll talk about it a little. But yeah, give me just a second to... Go over right here. Uh, okay. Oh, this is best played with a controller. Let me pull my controller out. And let me turn it on. Okay. Let's see. I am setting my timer for taking activated charcoal. Okay. So, the next game that we're coming up to is 1000X Resist. I don't know if it's like... I don't know if it's like something you don't like pronounce, kind of like uh, Hunter x Hunter. I'm saying it deliberately off because it's funnier to me that way. But um, <laughs> I don't know if the X is something you pronounce or not. Uh, but this is a hyper cinematic adventure. You are a clone. You live at the world's end. You worship the last surviving human, the All Mother. When a dangerous rumor shatters your faith, you phase through time and memory to expose a, a thousand year old lie. Relive, reclaim, Resist. So this is 1000x resist. Here's the steam. Oof, excuse me. There's the steam. There's the pin. Let me change it on my category. And done. All right, let's switch over back to the game. There we go. Uh, let's see. I can just immediately go to the settings, which is great. I will turn the music down just in case, because I love myself. That'll probably be okay. Um, I don't know if I need to invert my camera yet or not, so I'll keep it as it is. Uh, oh, this is about the uh, game. Oh, content warnings. Let's go. Okay. Let's go. Let me... Let me revise my pinned... My pinned uh, message. Content warnings. Racism. Murder. Blood. Looks like there is a jump scare. Disease. Emotional abuse. existential despair offensive language i really love when games put their content warnings that's great i'm very happy about that i think that's really fucking cool all right let's go in especially when it's like you don't have to see it if you don't want to if you're like oh i'd rather just go into this game blind that's fine you don't have to, but if you're like, oh, some things really bother me. Like, I'm very glad to know that there is going to be some racism in this because now I'm like prepared for it, you know? I just think more games should do this. I'm very, I'm very adamant about this. <laughs> Hope it's voiced. If it's not voiced, that's okay. There's a nest with a pattern. Oh my god, it's voice. There's a nearness and its gravity is echoing. Sister, what are you doing out here? This game looks beautiful, though. You mustn't interrupt the incantation. You know, this is Mother's time. Hmm. What is it that cannot wait? Wow. 
watcher. Oh. You don't look like you're here for a friendly greeting. Uh. I don't know what any of these mean. Red to blue, mother. I gave up everything to walk beside you. Oh, fuck! I mean, I knew she had the knife, but... I didn't expect she was gonna use it. I thought they were gonna talk a little first. Why'd you kill her? She was so sexy. Aha! You... You stole our immunity. Oh? <laughs> Killing is sexy, amen. Oh, hold on, my controller died. Let me plug it in. You condemned us to this life. Why do you get to choose who lives and who dies? Oh, wait, who's that? Is that me? We resistant, y'all. I don't know if it's loading or not. I think it's loading. Can't tell. I just hope it didn't break. And that's something I can't tell. Are you good? Are you loading? Or did you break? Let me know. Let me know, game. Um. I think it broke. I'm pressing all the buttons, but I think it broke. Hold on. Uh, that's not what I'm looking for. I'm looking for this, but... Yeah, I think I think it broke. Hold on. Oh, it didn't. Why did that? Did they need to give me an indication. <laughs> Six months earlier, it said. Yeah, I need like some sort of loading screen. Uh, let me write that down somewhere. Uh, I'll write it on this. Uh... Huh. Uh, oh, there we go. Can you hear me? Needs loading screen. There we go. I can. You made it through. How do you feel? Head hurts. Try to focus. Today is the day you finally enact your function. I'm ready to serve. I see your resolve, Watcher. But be warned. Communions can be disorienting. Communions? These memories belong to her, and in here, you will not be yourself. Others will see you as the All-Mother. Huh. Nowhere said people used to have names. It's true. These names were opaque keywords, a relic from a different time. The All Mother's name was Iris. Oh, Iris. Watch I killed Iris. To find me in Six months from now. It is a gathering place for recreation, north of where you are. Understood. Perform your function faithfully, and one day you will behold her. Uh, I will be. Uh, unrelent- uh... Meticulous. Hair to hair. Hair to hair, sister. What? Okay. See you on the other side. Grace to the All-Mother. Grace to the All-Mother. Okay, I guess I'm learning as I go. That's actually pretty cool. Um, L to move. Okay. 
access device our conversation is operational a primitive machine I believe this one belonged to the all mother oh are you the secretary These are her voice recordings let's listen to 10 month I'm having a bad allergic reaction to the medication it gives me a headache and makes me bleed at all the wrong times of the month okay so that was 10 month day 27 Let's do 11 month, day 12. The flood is lasting a lot longer this season. I'm cutting my own bangs in the bathtub again. Okay. How about 4 month? It's 2 a.m. and I'm eating lapchung cold from the fridge. I try dancing in front of the mirror to see what I look like from behind. Hard to tell. How are you gonna tell? You need another- you need two mirrors! Has anywhere between 50 million and 250 million base pairs. Spent all of Block B online shopping for a new personality. Free shipping. Maybe to arrive just in time for the dance. What the fuck? I've okay. never heard her voice before. Weird. Oh, hold on. What are these functions? These are names, Watcher. Unique strings assigned to people animals and objects of affection they're irrespective of function curious connor yeah it really is oh okay Walker. secretary what is this a combination lock for the safekeeping and security of student possessions such as the vibes is wild Please, positive be yeah specific. really learning squares studying cubes Powders and minerals for beautification and personal items of sentimental value. How does it work? A password, made of numbers and directional choreography. There must have been rampant theft. Either that, or rampant distrust. I feel sorry for them. I don't think that's the right way to go. Oh. I can't, like, turn my camera. Watcher, there's someone up ahead. I don't. Why is it so dark in this fucking place? A student here. It looks like it was a nice school. It all seems like an eternity ago, doesn't it? The world has changed, but you look like you haven't aged a day. You're a natural iris. Who are you? I'm just a grunt. Why else would he bring me along? I don't know. I'm here to protect you. Disposable. Wind is, is here. This? Lost track of time already. What does time feel like to you? Do we all look like we're moving slowly? How does it feel to know you're going to outlive us all? What are you doing here? This was your idea. I don't know how you convinced him. Honestly, I don't want to know. Hmm. I'm learning a lot and not anything. Go to the gymnasium. Okay, where's the gym? Probably not up here. What's this way? Go away. Hi. hi. Iris, come on. You can tell me. Why did you really want to come back here? Is this about that girl you draw all the time? I don't have any answers. Do you remember when I was young? I used to have a crush on you. Now here we are. I look older than you. You may be frozen in time, but your eyes have dimmed. Please don't do anything you'll regret. The vibes in this game are so weird! <laughs> yeah, right? Remember when you were dope and now you're not? Ooh. Uh. I don't know where the gym is. I don't think it's there. Is this outside? 
The gym this way? Oh, hi! Jesus Christ! Okay, that's the gym door. Cool. I remember seeing a picture of this gym in the news. There was some sort of school event, correct? It was a perfect spreader scenario. Oh. I couldn't believe it when I first read it. Everyone got sick. Everyone but you. The All-Mother is blessed. <laughs> Speaking in the third person again. With each passing day, your condition seems more and more like a curse. There will be no easy way out for you, Iris. No relief. Think of me, will you? A thousand years from now, when your only hope is a scalpel of your own. Man, wild. There's no data here, Watcher. Why? We can only experience what the All Mother has experienced. Oh, so I guess the All Mother didn't go to the gym. We're trapped. <laughs> then where is Principal? Principal must be waiting for us in another time period. We will need to find connecting memories <coughs> to reach her. <coughs> Excuse me. I guess she's not taking it easy on me. Principal is only ensuring that you learn. I'm sensing a strange entity on the rooftop of this school. I gotta go to the roof? I just came down! They may be the key. We should seek them out. Agreed. I just came down and now I gotta go back up? You kidding me? Ugh, let's go back in. So this oh, is why we're here. Oh, hey, Jesus! You almost had me, Iris. Your theory about socialized immunity—what an elaborate lie! Also, I'd bring you here to light candles. It must be important. I get the call for ritual. Each and every one of us, we've lost people too, but you—you've put dozens of lives at risk, not least of which your own. I hope you've enjoyed your little excursion. You will not have another one for a very long time. You Jesus. are unkind. Yeah. Just you wait. Are you so mean? Okay, I guess the roof is it's not through there. Oh, what the fuck? Hello? Iris, is that you? It's me, <clears throat> Yao. No, you're a picture. I'm so relieved to see you. I've missed you. Let me guess. You finished with straight A's. Did you get into that expensive school? How's that boy you like? Do you still like him? I want to get inside the gymnasium. Can you help me do that? The gym. One of my favorite moments with you happened there. That's loud music. Everyone dancing together. Hymns, don't you oh. remember? Sorry, I missed it. And seeing you laugh for the first time, it was worth it. I I'm sorry, no. Mm -hmm. What about this? Let me help. I'll send you back to that time, and we can meet each other all over again. Back when I had a body. Ah. Watcher, this is strange. I am reading multiple Jow entities all of a sudden. Scary. Multiple? What do you mean? Come visit again when you remember everything. Bye bye. Oh. Okay. Did you see the footage? Where do you think it came from? What did you see? A huge body. The occupants. Oh, I saw that shit huh? too. Is that what they're called? They walk the surface in my time. They're walking around now? Are they friendly? Uh, are they friendly? I yeah. hope oh, they don't go. hurt us. Spare me and my sister and my mom and my dad. Are they why people are getting sick? They look so majestic in that video. Do you think they're real? I've never seen one in person. You think they're dangerous? Stay away. Far away. A visitor? An alien? Exciting. 
Man, this game is so weird. Good. Iris, don't <coughs> ever speak to me again. What? What did I do? Now that my video has over two million views, I don't need you anymore. What did I, I do? Into the mountains. I saw it with my own eyes. Oh, okay. The body, it spoke to me. Don't you see? This is our moment to be more. Yeah, they really did get no the vibe meetings, they were going for. No more jobs, no more debt, none of it. Their arrival will free us all. Um, I strike their pose. I don't think so, buddy. Hold R1 to jump Iris. to a future time. Don't tell me you're here to join them. I'm here to observe. Good. I'm all for freedom of worship, but <clears throat> this is unhealthy. We worship the All Mother. The All Mother is she, she some kind of internet star? She is a god. Oh, geez, when the kids get so zealous. <laughs> through some strange events, but <laughs> a glowing red body the size of a building. You can't believe everything you see. Look, this guy doesn't have a name, but I love his I voice need to get acting. Past you. Sorry. No. No can do. We're keeping these kids isolated. We don't want them to mingle with the rest of the student body. Oh. Okay. There we go. Oh, there's another one. Oh, I haven't been to it yet. Okay. Uh, I'm still going to the gym. Let's see. Let's see. Uh, this is the wrong way, though. Hello. Iris! Just the person I wanted to see. You want to sign my yearbook? Yes. Sure. <laughs> huh. Is this your new gamer tag or something? It's my name. Mm -hmm. You're welcome. <laughs> The whole catalog is a mess. Your function is nowhere. I'm just an assistant here. If we lock down, then I'm out of a function. You'll be incinerated. It sure oh. feels that way in this economy. Yeah, a gamer tag. I've been reading about diseases. Some ended with a vaccine. Some ended up going away. This one seems different. News is saying it mutates every time it infects a person. Some people get sick really fast. Some people get sick really slow. I wonder, do some people not get sick at all? I've been looking up cloning. I thought it was new, but pets have been cloned since the early 2000s. A lady had her dead cat cloned. It was a 100% genetic match. But it ended up different. Different? How? The original was orange, but the clone huh. had gray streaks. They had different personalities, too. The original was shy, but the copy was outgoing. I want to grow up to be rich so I can clone my cats. Okay, buddy. I can't believe it. My last school dance. What songs will they play? Fast songs? Slow songs? Uh... Wow, it's a school dance. Slow? Walking through the crowd to find a partner. Everyone passing by each other. <coughs> will I remember all those faces when I leave this place? You will remember them. I hope. Buddy, you're a high they schooler. remember me? Buddy, you're a high schooler. You're thinking too much. Them. Sorry, I had to sneeze. <laughs> uh, is this how I go outside? Yeah, there we go. I don't want to work in a cafe. I don't want to work in a cafe. Oh, okay, I can't talk to you. Maybe I'll join the army. Can't get in here now either. Maybe I'll join the army. You sure I can't interact with you? No, I'll I can't never interact get a with scholarship. you. All right, have a good one. I hope they take requests tonight. 
Oh, these fuckers kissing. Mm -hmm. This is, uh, it's for research. Mm -hmm. How, how can I share an experience? Okay. Technology. What? What did you say? You seem distracted. I'll come back another time. I will let y'all do that. I'm trying to hear your kiss and voice acting. Their song. Yeah, research. <laughs> Iris, if the school locks down, you're gonna have a lot of free time. I want you to draw. I can draw? Your last self-portrait was good. Seize your talent. Otherwise, life is an unending stream of prep and marking, meetings, and parent-teacher meetings. Children. Iris, never have children. You just don't know what they will get up to. Promise me. Oh, okay. I have to show my parents I can do it. Otherwise, they'll make me study law. Why they already call her law student? You'll always have a choice in your function. Just be glad to have one. You sound so much like them. Do you have any idea how hard the bar exam is? My feet are throbbing. I've been standing here for hours. She uh. said she'd go to the dance with me. Is this what love is like? What is it like? Never getting what you want. Damn. We love the All-Mother, but never expect anything in return. We just hope to one day bask in her presence. And her presence will be enough for you? Yes. I guess after a while I'd hoped she'd really... see me. How long can I wait? For her love, I would wait forever. Wow. That makes me weak in the knees. <laughs> okay, buddy. Oh, artist. Ugh. Why can't I capture him? What am I missing? Talent? I'm kidding. Probably just don't got the right pen. Ah, uh, his chin. The painted boy's chin points to the floor. But in reality, he tilts his head up to gaze at <laughs> No! You're right. Why didn't I see that? You've got an eye for these things. It is my function to observe. What does the work make you think of? Longing. His longing. I shall title it a boy longing. Oh my god, please take him to the dance. He loves you so much. Uh Science student. Oh my god, why is your screen red? Fascinating. I've never seen cells organize in this way. What are you observing? Me. My body is sick with this nasty little thing. What an opportunity to be both subject and observer. To view my own insides from the outside. Oh, Chris. What do you observe? Hmm. Triangles. Helixes. The very fabric of me is transforming. <clears throat> Oof. You will be remembered. By everyone? I mean, wow, Iris. Everybody said you were toxic, but you're not so bad. Oh. Achoo. Gross student. <sighs> you know what? Worrying will only make it worse. <clears throat> I'm just gonna sweat it out at the dance. No. Not a good idea. We've all been waiting years for a grand <clears throat> dance. Ugh. Everybody knows the risk. We He's sneezing while ourselves. adjusting food. Or beakers? I don't know. Looks like you're in a science classroom. <sighs> Another group assignment I'll be doing on my own. My study Oop, partner stuck was in a walking to animation. <laughs> what a dud. If only I could make copies of myself. Wouldn't that be a dream? Would you be kind to your copies? Be kind to myself? <laughs> Hard to say. That's fair. Exams are gonna kill me. Me too. Don't worry. Uh, okay. I think I'm still looking for her. Do I feel sick? 
Probably a well. I'll catch it for sure. Stuff about Zhao. Hmm. Ah. Poor Zhao. It's about Zhao. What about Zhao? You hear what Iris said? What happened? Fuckers? <laughs> Stress, anxiety, depression, or deadly disease? Scary. Very scary. Um, let's see. Is she in there? It looks like it. Iris, this classroom is off limits. Why? What you said about Zhao. It was highly inappropriate. We've notified your parents. What did I say? Don't what get cheeky say? with me. I'm being serious. Zhao Genuinely. seems to have no idea what you said. Or maybe she's pretending not to know. I'm not sure. Is she inside? I'm keeping her away from all of this commotion. Do you understand? Think about your actions, Iris. They have consequences. Well, I'm just gonna go to the future. And I'm gonna go in. There we go. Are you? Okay, you're Zhao. I'll come back to you. I gotta talk to everyone else. Stupid kids have to study. Smart kids get to go home. Don't say that. People learn differently. <laughs> How do you start beatboxing? What are you doing? Doing my time in oppressed white collar. I was sipping my juice from a box when I saw her. She walks in clean, a straw and a wrapper. No crime on record when she gave me a holler. Behind the bars of detention, paying no attention. No rap, no rhyme, just laying down a sentence. People learn different. Who am I to say no? Bad kids stay, the good kids go. Are you okay, buddy? Wait a minute. Is this a holding cell? What does it look like to you? Oh, poor guy. It's so beautiful outside. The trees. Look at them moving on their own. They look so real. Of course they look real. They are real. <laughs> yes. Yes, of course. I'm much happier here. No expectations. Iris, I did exactly what you dared me. What did I, I dare, dare you? To you? I changed the votes for the art jingsai. Now you can get the scholarship oh. you need. Oh, that's pretty serious. Wait, how could this be your assigned function? Did it work? Did you win the jingsai? I don't know. But when they announce it, you'll tell me. And then we can have the sleepover you promised. I... I'm not certain. I can't wait. I already bought snacks. Oh, okay. Model minority. Press L2 to look around and zip to a point. Press L1 to release the zip. Oh. Okay. Uh, can I do more than one? Yeah. Okay. Uh, where am I going now? Uh. Oh, that's the place I zipped to. Okay. Where Where are we going? Where am I going? Uh. Oh, I can zip there. I think I think I can zip there. Ooh. Okay. Uh, uh, that way? Uh, this way? Oh! Yeah, I, I guess there. I genuinely don't know where I'm going. Oh! Aha! The phone! A smartphone. A pocket sized mobile mechanism of telecommunication and computing functions. Beyond call and messaging, 
it allows for extensive internet browsing and multimedia functionality, including music, video, photo, and gaming. You spent more time with your phone than anything or anyone. You would turn your phone on to turn off the anxious, stressful, anguished thoughts. Your parents were fighting about the past again. Momoi, your mom needs help, your dad said. There was no sound worse than your mother shrieking. You locked your bedroom and crawled into bed. You squeezed yourself into the smallest shape possible under the covers. Ah. You spoke to your phone, and it spoke back. Wow. Okay. Um. Where to next? Uh. way uh let's see hmm not sure where to go from here uh this way I guess This is the only thing in here that's seems of importance. Oh, except that bag. No. from here I don't know where to go next oh oh found it okay 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 there we go aha what's going on here iris there's a new bubble waffle cafe that just opened your mom says it's your favorite and I was like Huh? It's my favorite, too. <laughs> Jiao. Your hair. Your outfit. What the hell? What do you mean? Y'all are wearing the same yeah. shit! You said no one will like me until I'm not so... I didn't tell you to copy everything I do. But you are my... Uh... Role model? Are you trying to ruin my life? I'm sorry! I wanted it to be a fun surprise. Like twins. No. So you don't like bubble waffle? For fuck's sake. All you ever talk about is bubble waffle this, milk toast that. Why can't you just act normal? Oof. Watcher, you did it. We're back. Don't see where the race down comes in. Go on. I'm detecting more Jiao entities in this time period. We should continue looking. Anything else? I didn't mean to offend. We'll talk about it when we get home. I don't know what Secretary did. 
All right, let's see. Maybe it's a Chinese thing. What do you mean? Attention! Attention! Please! I know I'm supposed to uphold due process, but I don't want to spend the last week of school like this. Fair. The political class makes me sick. I wanted to take the politics out of governance. President. So many presidents are done by this. They live in the shadow of their mistakes. Why is there why is there a taxidermy wolf? Attention! Attention! Please! Oh dear. I was looking forward to practicing my note-taking skills, but every week I write the same thing. We should wipe the records. Oh. <laughs> that will be all, class president. Wait, wait. It would be unparliamentary to uh, nom 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 nom. Just let him speak. <sighs> Thank you. I know we're over time, but this damn fox needs to be resolved. We are fox? already so over budget. If we spend any more money on this fox statue, it's the context for this fox is completely lost to us. I see no alternative but to throw it away, burn the records, and start anew. But y'all still pay for Judas. it. Judas. Judas. <laughs> Past councils wanted this. Someone believed in this fox statue. It has to mean something. What Please. The fuck? We need to set future student councils free. Let us finish this once and for all. Enough. This meeting is overtime. We're all due at the gym immediately. Oh, that damned graduation dance. Money maker, my ass. Fair enough. How did this happen? I do not want university recruiters to know I presided over these budgets. What the fuck is going on with y'all? Those glowing Jeez. giants. Those alien things? All Paint if I see I'm one. Scared? Okay, I am. Some shit like that. Okay, that's the roof. I don't. I don't think she's up there, but just in case, let me check. Uh, future. Future. Uh, no, nah, she ain't up here. Okay. Uh, let's go down this way. Oh wait, hold on. Let me talk to a journalist. Look I haven't talked them. to him yet. Or her yet. They're scared. <clears throat> I've got to stay impartial for the school paper. But between you and me, they're a bit out of it. You see that guy? He claims to have met one of those aliens in person. I'm waiting here for an interview. I want to leave. Sorry, Iris. I was told to help keep everyone here. <gasps> How did I get roped into this? I'd rather be prepping for the dance tonight. I'm such a good dancer. I trust you. Alright, let's go this way. I don't like the look of this. My brother's so stubborn. I've never met a boy before today. <laughs> well, count yourself lucky. Please don't tell anyone it was him. We have enough trouble at home already. I don't know what he did. Iris, don't come in here. Someone is sick. Your healer. That's very kind of you to say. But I'm being serious. He's been attending school for days, hiding his sickness. Fuck Why it. are we all not sick yet? Maybe we can stop it before it's full blown. You're missing some essential tools. You'll need something to absorb the water. It leaks from the eyes until it's all gone. That's so scary. Bodies have so much water. He has been crying all day. I'll look into it. Thank you, Iris. It's certain. I should have it by now. Why do I feel fine? Are you also a nurse? Okay. I'm dead. <laughs> I'm kidding. Not funny. People are scared. I'll be fine. I'm young. Your eyes are watering. So what? You, you never seen someone 
cry before. I really like yeah. the way they're kind of telling the story here. We're like, you know, just bit by bit piecing Spray together what the fuck happened. I saw Chow lock themselves in there. Oh god. I need to practice. My piano teacher is going to kill me. Ugh, yours and mine both. Alright, let's go forward. You're hiding. Is it a game? Or is there danger? Please share. When I'm scared, I sweat so much. Ooh, me too. So it is danger. You are acting funny, Iris. Survive at all costs. No worries. The instruments won't hurt me. Eh. It smells funny in here, though. <sighs> Maybe I just won't say a single word all year. Or the rest of my life. Let's go to the food court after school. I promise I won't tell any of your friends. God, she just wants to hang out with you. Okay, here we are. Let's see. Uh, oh, there's something down there. What's this? Oh, it's a little piano. The piano consists of 88 keys. Each key is attached to a hammer that strikes a string. These strings resonate at specific frequencies. Most pianos use a tuning system called 12-tone equal temperament, which carves an octave into 12 steps. You hated the piano. It was an ugly, rigid instrument. One day, you watched a friend pluck a string of a guitar. With every pluck, the sound was different. Complex. When you tried to play a song together, the piano sounded wrong. After they left, you took the instrument apart. Maybe you could oh. get at the strings, you thought. Ha! When your parents discovered that you had damaged the piano by accident, they hit you. After all, they were still paying for it. As an adult, you recalled this incident. You vowed that you would never make something without a keen sense of chaos. Hmm. Wow. All right. Let's continue. Um, let's go to this one, and to this one, and this one. But I'm trying to get up. Ooh, ooh, I'm falling. Um, let's see. Let's go to this one. Let's go. Oh! Oh no, that's where I was. Okay, okay. Uh, let's see. Let's go here for a sec. Oh, there's some below. Okay, cool. Uh, let's see. Gotta go this way. And that way. Is there anything under there? Doesn't seem like it. So let's go this way. And this way. And this way. And... Uh... Oh! Oh! Ooh. That'll work. Okay. Th that way. Yeah, I'm getting the hang of this shit. Your Nampayo. He's cool. Huh? <laughs> who? Oh, you know who. The one in the bathroom. You are always skipping class to meet him. Uh, I... You like him. 
What? No? You don't like him? You don't know anything, Zhao. He's not my boyfriend. And even if I did like him, there's no reason he'd like me. Oh? Why? Iris, you are crazy. There are so many reasons. You never smile with your teeth. Except when you're thinking about food. And when you are sad, you like to untie your hair and then tie it back up over and over again. Oh, and you always smell like lavender and strawberry pocky. Very strange smell to always smell like, him, but okay. If you were him? There's no way I could have a boyfriend. Ugh, my mom would lose her shit. She's always losing her shit. Oh, but your mom is so nice. She gave me new clothes. You don't know what she's really like. My mom is a coward. Damn. Why do you say this about to your mom? My parents were there, you know? All the ugliest things they saw with their own eyes. But one night, my mom packed all their things and forced my dad to flee with her. They abandoned their friends, their family, the cause. Hmm. Not like your dad. He stayed. Your father was different. But my mom? <laughs> She's the weakest person I know. Hmm. Well, at least your mom is alive. Damn. All right. Let's get out of here. Uh, I guess we'll find Jow somewhere you else. Let's go down here. Hmm. Oh, wait. I've been here. Will I wear? Yeah, I've been here. Okay, let's I see. Is the gym ready yet? Quests tonight. Looks like I'll the gym's still not ready. already have I gone this way I don't think so oh hello iris, smoking student iris almost graduated hey you are in the washroom I sure am and I'm gonna stay here flunked history by one percent damn that sucks. That sucks, buddy. You still taking off to another continent? One day. When graced. I'm gonna miss our hangs, eh? And you showing me your drawings. I'll be sure to hold on to that one you gave me, you know, for when you're famous. <laughs> and if you're ever looking for me, well... You know where to find me. Here? Here. Damn. Was that obvious? All right. Let's get out of here. No. It's our last dance. Ooh. I can't cancel it. Oh. Oh, hey, it's Iris. Hey, guys. Are we in your way? A fucking little bit. Yes. Too bad. I heard what you said about Zhao. Yeah, you're a bitch. Hey. Yeah. When did you become such an asshole? I... I don't know. Do you? Sure. Play innocent. No one will believe you. I hope you get sick. Damn. Yeah. This is our spot. Go find your own spot. Okay, well, I'm just gonna go to the future and go past you. There we go. Fuck you guys. Is that 
My mom told us to pack all of our things. An abundance of caution? What does that even mean? I think she got spooked by that obviously fake video. What video? You haven't seen it? No. It's not worth your time. That creepy kid uploaded it. He's just got nothing better to do than to trick people. It's gotta be that giant statue, I'm guessing. Yo, Hello. Girl, I'm selling. You buying? No. No. Chill. Aren't you Asians all about grades and working hard and shit? Uh, and I'll bet your mom sure likes being proud of you. Jeez, what the fuck? Okay. Let's see. Okay, Jow's over there, There's so let me talk to everyone else water. first. I can't talk to you. Let me talk to you, though. I'm an emerald and pewter. Such pretty colors. Such gentle coos. Eat up. There's enough food for everyone. There's only one bird! Carry diseases. Walls keep the wild things out. Pigeons are not wild. They are feral. Oh, Our okay. ancestors captured them and turned them into tools. Brought them over oceans. They were abandoned? Exactly. And so they make a home on a strange land. Students. Pigeons. We are all visitors here. I mean, she's got a point. Alright, let's talk to Zhao here. I eat so much. I'm like a... What's the word in English? Lachitong. What did you just say? Come on, you know. Aren't you Shangaren? I don't understand you. Oh, right. I keep forgetting you don't speak Mandarin. I mean... Lapsaptong? Uh, this I understand. Oh, so we all know Cantonese. You do? But how? Is this another language? Dumpster. That's the word. They should call me Dumpster Jiao. <laughs> okay. I can call you Dumpster Jiao. No! <laughs> uh, no. Please don't. Yeah, <laughs> please don't. What's the meaning of Dumpster Jiao? Hmm? Every sister has a name, and their name reveals their assigned function. Dumpster Jiao's function is to eat. A lot! You know I eat a lot when I'm sad. Eating cures sadness? Uh, not really. It just makes you fat. Feels good, though. Oh. Why are you sad and fat? Well, you won't take me to the dance, and I only want to go with you. Aw, okay. Okay, here we go. Dog eat dog. Um, where are we going? Where are we dropping? Not that way, I'll tell you that. Okay, I'll tell you that way. Uh, let's see. I'm looking for a memory. But it looks like I have to go this way first. I can't get over there, so I guess it's not relevant. Uh, let's see, let's see, where can I go? All the way over there? I can't quite make it over there though. Uh, let's see. Let's see, let's see. This is where I came from. Okay, but I can go like over there? No, so if I go this way, then maybe I fall a little? Oh! I didn't realize I could step here. Yeah! This is a common book bag, spacious and functional. It can be carried with the shoulder or by the hand. The first time Jiao emptied the contents of this bag, at the cafeteria table, you were so embarrassed. She had latched onto you since her first day. Yet when others asked who she was, 
You said no one. Man, we were a dick. When she spoke, you apologized. Ni fang xue hao, you kong ma? She asked. You came here, so speak the language, he whispered. Besides, that's not the Chinese you spoke, and people don't like it when they don't understand you. Chew with your mouth closed. Don't clear your throat in public like that. And absolutely do not spit on a public street. When your mom invited Jiao over for dinner, you asked, Do we have to include her all the time? What's your problem? Your mom said. Why does she bother you so much? You didn't have an answer. Oof. All right. Getting a little bit of that lore. There we go. Oh, I think I can just, yeah, just land. Are you okay? Yep. You are never by yourself at lunch. Whatever. Where are your friends? I don't know. Why would I know? The four of us have eaten lunch together every day. Every day. For years. I guess yesterday was the last day and no one bothered to tell me. They are afraid of getting sick from people like us. Ah, but I was born here. It makes no sense. My dad always says, a family that eats together stays together. You ever heard that? It's bullshit. My mom and I eat and watch true crime every night. It's how we study English. Hmm. Good for you. Well, you can sit with me. There's lots of room. <laughs> uh -huh. No thanks. Uh -huh. But we need to- Zhao, you need to work on your English comprehension. Uh, I'm trying. Owie. Oh, there's a giant fucking thing out there. Look at that shit. Um. Where am I? Oh, okay. Them again. Is that spit on your back? I hope so. Hi, Skirp. Thank you for the head pads. Because if it's not spit, then it is something else. Here, take that off. We can soak it in the washroom sink. I have an extra sweater you can wear. What? You will let me wear your sweater? Put it on before I change my mind. Hmm. You look good. No, I probably still look like a F.O.B. Like you say. I mean it. The color suits you. I thought you hate when I look like you. That is what you said. To be honest, you'll never look like me. Ah! You don't have the resting bitch face. Ah, okay, okay. Oh. <laughs> hey, are they always so mean in this country? I promise that after we graduate, everything will be different. We will have freedom choices experiences that you can't even imagine right now what do you mean i mean you'll go to parties go on dates join an ultimate frisbee team who knows what else i love frisbee i know you do Dashua, where will you go as far from my parents as possible mm. where will you go Hmm. It would be fun if we went together, right? Is that it? Is there more? No? That seems to be it. Okay. Uh oh. Oh, okay. It's got a little bit bigger. Let's see. Oh, okay. Uh, I can get up there. Let's go. Uh, 
there's nothing over here, so... Can I reach that? Oh no, but I can reach this. Yeah! Oh, but can I go... I can go that way to that. But let's try anyway. Uh, <laughs> is that where I came from? No, that's where I came from. Okay, let's do it. contains water, lipids, lysozyme, lipocalin, glucose, and sodium. If the tear expels from the right eye, it means happiness. If it falls from the left eye, it's sadness. Tears are functionless. Worse, they are a threat. You learned this on the parking lot pavement the day your mother taught you to ride a bike. Mm. It hurts. You cried cradling your skinned knee. Your mother looked down at you with disdain. Mumui, look around, she said. Everyone is staring. How was the fall? <laughs> at this nice, beautiful moment, it does not seem like it was good for her. <laughs> you tried so hard to stop crying, but it only made it worse. When you asked why, your mother said, otherwise, they'll take everything from you. Why would they take my things? You asked. Because it is in their nature. Never let them see you cry. Understand? Many years later, you remembered this lesson when they defaced your locker and stole your clothes after swimming practice. Oh. The first sign of sickness is watering of the eyes and nose. Every student who showed any sign of tears was sent home. You went into the pool and dunked your head under water so no one would see. All right, looks like we found the multiple Zhao entities. You're back. It was fun to spend all those times together again, right? I'm not sure. It's okay, Iris. Yeah. Everything is okay now. It's really it neat, weird. Yes. Now that we are friends again. Iris. You will come back to visit me? Please. Tomorrow? Promise you will come tomorrow. Yes. And will you tell my dad to bring my favorite snacks? I'm starving. Yes. I hope you find what you are looking for at the gym. I'll never forget to that night. All right, return to the gym in zero one time. Oh, that's where I am. Okay, cool. Old R2 to run. I love that I never had to run until now. What? Oh. Oh, they're dancing. I thought they were T posing, and I'm like, what are you doing? All right, let's go in the gym. Woo. Oh, I can't go there yet. This isn't right. This is scary. Secretary, diagnose. Where are we? Impossible to say. My readings are inconclusive. Be useful. God damn. My diagnosis. I believe this is a repressed memory. Are we in danger? Very likely. I'm trying to contact the others, but to no avail, we are several layers deeper than we should be. We will have to find a way out ourselves. Keep your guard up. If I gotta fight, I I'm to gonna live. be mad. <laughs> I'll keep that in mind. 
Iris. You. Why would you do that to me? Oh my god, what did I do to you? I didn't want to believe it. Zhao, do you know a way out of this place? Uh, this way. Are you going to just run away from me? Like always. Ooh. You know, I wanted to run away too. I beg, Ma. Why can't we leave? Why can't we go back home? I cried and cried. Until I met you. What? Alright, no worries. Have a good lurk. You told everyone. What did I tell? Dance. Oh. They said so. Iris, that was only for you to see. What did I tell them? I need you to listen to me. I'm not Iris. I tried. You know. I thought if I became just like Iris and made Jow disappear, maybe you would. Alright. The storytelling in this is so nice. I so good. Understand. I get it now. <laughs> it's what I deserve. You have been trying to teach me all along. Something's gone wrong. I need your help. No worries. Zhao can handle it. Um, we're not gonna talk about that game here. Your eyes, Zhao. No, no. I'm not crying, Iris. You said never show weakness. I don't forget the things you say. Ah, it burns! Everything is so blurry. Are you still there, Iris? Secretary, what can I do? Is this the only outcome? This happened already, Watcher. A long time ago, there's nothing to be done. So, no worries, okay? Some worries! Tell them everything about me. Tell them whatever you want. As long as I can keep leaving you letters in your locker. Oh, you're running towards that giant thing. If I can keep watching you dance. Making videos of you. <laughs> as long as you will come to sleep over. And we can stay up all night. <laughs> then no worries. Go ahead. Tell everyone. They can keep laughing and hating me. I can tell know why. Oh. I can take it. Okay. I don't know why. Because I am Dumpster Jow! Right? Right? Just a dumpster. <coughs> Just your dumpster! I don't like how you're getting closer to this thing. See? My mouth is wide open. Go ahead, Iris. <coughs> Put your garbage in me. Oh, this is the last one. Uh-oh. Oh, fuck. Ah. Uh. 
Uh, oh fuck. What a compelling fucking game, am I right? Wishlist the hell out of this game if you thought it was cool. I really... I really don't want to go into it, but you know what? You know what? Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to put a few Twitter links in my Discord for you. And that'll help a little bit more. Maybe that'll help you. I think that's all I'll say on that here. Because I'm trying not to make this into a big deal. But it's kind of a really big deal. It's kind of a really, really big deal. And um, after you read that, if you still decide to play the wizard game, we might have to have a conversation. Because I am not. <laughs> I'm being very, um, how do I explain? I'm not supporting people that play that game. So if I give you all the information and you still decide that's what you want to do, we might have to have a conversation. Anyway, so this is a thousand resist. Wish list it, tell your friends, tell your family. It's a pretty full, cool fucking game. Um, we are going to, first I'm going to switch to my BRB screen. Um, we're going to switch just a little bit to, um, I don't want to say a lower graphic game, but it is definitely a completely different game than this. Um, it's called On the Peril of Parrots. So this is also by uh, a black creator. Happy Black History Month. I'm black. I like playing games by black creators. Give me money. Um, so, hi! Yeah, listen. Listen, this game is cool as hell. I'm really looking forward to it. <laughs> Thank you for making this game. It's so weird in a good way. It's so good weird. I'm very looking forward to seeing what you guys come out with. Oh man, it was it was an experience. <laughs> Woo! Um okay. So we're playing on the peril of on the peril of parrots. Explore anxieties around artificial intelligence by solving color-based challenges and collecting cookies. So let me I've already changed it. I'm already ahead of the game here. <laughs> oh good, IRL simulation. <laughs> also, thanks for the follow, I really appreciate it. I also like how the game started and it didn't blow off my ears. I know that not every dev can um, not make that happen, but it was very nice. <laughs> it's been it's been a trial for some of these demos. I love a lot of demos, and I love all these demos. I even love the demos that blow my ears off, but I wish they didn't. So it was nice to come to a game that didn't do that. <laughs> okay. Let me switch. Back to my games. I already pinned this. Cool. I'm ahead of the game. This one is... A keyboard game. Initiating procedural operating layered linguistic intelligence experiment one. As a refresher, this involves a subject completing a random series of puzzles. I didn't put anything yet, but I will after I finish streaming. 
Each puzzle will require you to cover all the tiles with a single color. Use the left, right, up and down arrow keys, or WASDA keys, to navigate the puzzle. Pressing space will restart a level. Pressing, press space to continue, okay. Earn cookies by completing levels. Collect cookies to earn different endings. Man, they really were hay. So, I saw this demo. I added it to my list very um, late in the game because I had a friend who was like, hey, you were telling me about, I was telling him about Super Space Club that I played. And he was like, hey, you should check out um, this game like developer because uh, he's a friend of mine. And I was like, okay. And one, he had a game that's already on my wish list. Two, he had a game in the demos. So I was like, okay, I'll check it out. That's where I am. All right, we earned a cookie. Oh. <laughs> we went from, hey, you did it, to good fucking luck. Oh my god. Uh-uh. Thinking, thinking about how to do this. Okay, I think I know how to do it. Hi, Fi, how are you? Uh, I should be able to do this. I should be able to do this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Woo! Um, it should just be the same way, but I forgot how I did it. I forgot. Okay, okay. Woo! I'm not good at these puzzles, but I'm trying my best. <laughs> oh, I think I see this one. I think I see it. Yeah, I see it. Oh, I'm so cool. Oh, man. Ah, oh, expert gamer. Okay, hold on. Yeah, expert gamer, let's go! Yeah! Big dick energy indeed! Oh no. Uh. Uh. Um. Okay, okay. Picking it up. Oh, oh, I did it. I did it. I did it. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Okay. Yeah! Woo! Oh, God. Um. Uh. I have to go this way. Ah, uh, ah. Uh, um. Oh, yeah, I got it. I got it. I got it. I'm gaming. Uh. Yeah, look at how cool I am. Don't worry, I will sign my autograph for you later. Yeah. Yeah. Woo, okay. Ah. Uh... Okay, I don't think I did this one. I didn't do this one.
Yeah, it's a good thing they aren't timed. Yeah, I see what I needed to do. Alright. Um, I think I saw what I needed to do. No! Don't you unless me! Uh... Nope. This was the end of my streak. You gotta sleep, then you gotta sleep. Ah, I'm not gonna get past this. Yeah, have a good night. I hope you have good dreams. I did, but that was almost there. Why not shoot all the way down at the beginning? Um, I don't know. This, this might work. Yeah, that's a work. We're pogging. Yeah, let's go. My mama told me to never give up and I didn't. Wow. I know, I'm so cool. Uh... Hmm. Nah, I fucked up. I have to go this way. Oh yeah, we got it. All right, we're pogging. Ah, uh, let's see. Nope, that's not it. Yeah, 
that should have been last, maybe? Let's see. Hmm. What if I did like this? The stakeholder asking you the stakeholders are asking you to consume the data set. Remember, a large data set means improved business performance. And improved business performance means more revenue. Sure. Oh, harder puzzles. Excellent. The shareholders will be pleased. Paintbrush does something. <laughs> Thank you, almighty capitalism man. <laughs> oh, what? Oh, no. Okay, I see what I needed to do. I think. Actually, what, what do I need to do? I really don't see how I can Oh! Oh! Gotcha! Okay Yes! I get it. Yeah, I'm a different color. Oh no. No no. Oh no, this is okay, this is okay. Yeah! Oh! It looks like flubs for a moment. Oh, no read that bonus, nice. Oh. This is the game. Alright. Puzzle games like this are not my forte. But this is on the Peril of Parrots. It looks really cool. Um. 
cool bossa nova music, cool color puzzles. If you're a puzzle, guy or gal or non-binary, this is for you. What's next on my list? The star named Aos. Let me switch real quick so that way I can update my category and read you guys what this demo is about. Let me save. Okay. The star named Eos. Capture photos and step back in time to experience the moments held within them in the star named Eos. Solve a variety of puzzles to help a young photographer uncover the truth about his mother's disappearance and rediscover the beauty that is to be found in the world. A str oh, Tamagotchi time. Okay, thank you. Thank you for the Tamagotchi time. Um, I'm actually also going to pee, so I'll be right back. Omo time, Scurve says. <laughs> okay, I'm doing my hydrating and I'm stretching. I hope you guys are having a good Saturday. I'm having a good Saturday. I actually, okay. So Moon Girl and Devil Dinosaur is coming out this week. It is coming out on Disney Plus on Wednesday. I need you all to watch it. I need Disney Plus to know that people want more uh, shows with black female protagonists. And it looks really good. It looks really great. Um, anyway, I thought it was supposed to come out yesterday. So I was like, oh, fuck, we got to watch it. But, you know, yesterday I was doing this. So this morning I was like, Alex, we got to watch it. But it doesn't come out till Wednesday. It came out on Disney Channel on Friday. But it doesn't come out on Disney Plus until Wednesday. You don't have it. I understand. You know, there's always another way to watch it. Is it legal? Absolutely. Probably. <laughs> Who lives in a pineapple under the sea? <laughs> very true, very true. Uh, but yeah, it looks like it's gonna be a great show. I, I love Moon Girl and Devil Dinosaur. It's so fun. Like, it's such a fun comic, so... And, like, all of the trailers that I've seen for it... Looks like it's gonna be a really good show. So, if you are a person with access to cable that can watch the Disney Channel, or you have access to Disney Plus, please go watch Moon Girl and Devil Dinosaur. I'll shout it from the rooftops. Please go watch it. <laughs> Alright, I'm starting up the star named Aos. Use headphones for best experience. That's what I got. Okay. And the, um, the 
sound does not make me want to die. So that's good. It's a good, it's a good, uh, volume. Let me link the game. And let's switch to the game. Hi guys, we're back. Oh, hi tiger. You're so cute. Okay. So. This is a game about photography. If you had another game that came out about photography, I'm not saying that this game is bad. I'm saying that variety is the spice of life. And if you want another game that also has photography, a game called Seasons just came out uh, last week. I think it was last week. Um, and it's a photo, a photography, a photography type game. And the protagonist is a black female. Um, I'm actually going to be playing it on two weeks from now, probably. So you'll be able to see it then. I already bought it, so there's not any extra buying I have to do. Uh, yes, thank you for starting this music at mid. I love it. All right, let's start. Yeah, pre-bought. You know I had to get that 10% discount and also to show them that I cared about the game to buy it very early. Day. Day. Wait a sec, dude. Have you ever looked forward to opening your eyes? I've looked forward to closing them. Oh, is that what I have to do? Hold on. Hold on. What are you- oh, okay, okay. Oh, hi! Oh! I'm small! <laughs> As someone who loves sleep? No. <laughs> Same. Is right in front of you. Uh. You see, yeah, I'm a baby! Everything shines. Everything. When you gaze at the stars, the stars also gaze at you. They do not fade away just because you close your eyes. Hmm. Nor will they be dimmed by fleeting clouds. Just open your eyes and you'll see shooting stars. <laughs> yeah, it really All is a wishes. wholesome The Void stares back. Oh, fuck! That was coming right at us, Mom! Day, are you asleep? Yes. <laughs> ah, blinded by science. <laughs> Man, look at the- Look at the fucking art and animation of this, guys! It's so not- Every game I play is like this. <laughs> I had that dream again. My room's a little dim. Better turn on the lights first. It's too dim in here. I can't see clearly. Okay, I'm going. I'm going. Where, where's your light switch? I see a fan. Oh. Can I move you? Oh. I, I think I gotta go that way. Can I open a window? Three out of three games waking up in a dark room and can't see for beans. You're right. <laughs> oh, I know. I'm I'm looking I'm looking for your for your light switch. Cuz I can't just press the light. You got a weird ass fucking Oh, it's July. Okay. Um can I- can I move? It's too dip- I- I know. I know, buddy, I'm trying to help you. Where's your light switch? Is there a remote like my room? Oh! I didn't think about that, hold on. Hmm. Hmm. Let's see. 
Let's see, let's see. Or a... Yeah, a... I didn't even think to look for a lamp. I didn't even think about... Oh. There's a lamp right here. Skirp, you beautiful... Brain, you. It's much brighter now. A letter addressed to me. Photo of a train window. You'll be able to take a better shot, Mom. Also, sorry if you can't see with the sun shining in your room. There's no hope for you. You're right! <laughs> I remember seeing a similar scene somewhere. Dear Day, how are you? I can't stop thinking about you during my travels. As a photographer, I have to capture beauty with my camera. I know you're more talented than I am, Day. And I believe you'll be able to find beauty in this world very soon. You see, everything shines. Everything. When you gaze at the stars, the stars also gaze at you. They do not fade away just because you close your eyes, nor will they be dimmed by fleeting clouds. Just open your eyes and you'll see shooting stars, full of wishes. I am writing this letter on the train to my destination. The red curtains and flowers make a good contrast against the greenery outside. Wish you were here to see it with me. Love, Mom. Okay, I don't know what's happening in this game so far, and I don't know what's going to happen, but I'm going to say this now without having context. I'm glad our mom is alive. The transition made it seem like maybe that wasn't the case, but I'm glad she's alive. I hope I'm not wrong. Woo! I wonder if mom's trip is going well. So far, mom ran away and left you at home alone as a baby. I think, I think I'm bigger now. I think I'm bigger now. This is the music box Mom gave me when I was little. Oh, okay, that's the picture. I feel like I've seen this before. I want to capture this scene, but how? Oof, buddy, aren't you a photographer? How do you know, Setsu? It's first person POV. Yeah, you're right. You got a point there. A puzzle box I made. I always look forward to aligning the stars. Oh, why I gotta do? Why I gotta do a sliding puzzle? I didn't come here for sliding puzzles. Um, I didn't come here for sliding puzzles. Uh. Uh, uh, how about that? <laughs> Whoops, uh, iPhone 4. Ah, better snap this. <laughs> uh, let's do that. Let's do that. Let's do that. No, that ain't gonna go anymore. <laughs> this will look good on my MySpace. <laughs> Did you- did you actually- you made the sound, but you didn't do anything. Are you gonna- Okay, that's fine. You're shy. That's fine. Hi, soul! How are you? Oh, okay. I can only pull out one at a time. Okay. Come on, you go out. Uh hmm. Hmm. Are you gonna fall down or what? I did Tamagotchi time. I went and peed. I came back. As I was talking about um as I was talking about Moon Girl and Double Dinosaur, I stretched. I promise. I wouldn't steer you wrong. Don't worry. Hi, Soliolio. I don't think it's... Well, no. It's definitely a puzzle game. But right now, there's a strange amount of puzzles. Kid, I'm sorry. Like, young you might be smart, but old you? With me at the mantle? Not smart at all. Sesu games featuring depression and puzzles. Yeah, though! Oh! Oh, hold on. Hold on. I'm, I'm picking up. 
My brain. My brain is picking up. These don't move. Okay. Um. Uh. Uh, what if I put this this way? Like this way. Now what if I did this like this? Now what if I did this like this? Now what if I put this in here? Yeah, get out of here. Get out of here. Okay, um... Now what if I did this, like this? Now what if I did this like this? And what if I did this, like this? Yeah, get out of here. Okay, 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 okay. I think I got it, I got it. Oh my god, we've done it. Almost. We've almost done it. Okay, that's fine. Uh, let's put that, no, I'm trying to put that more. Hmm. Let's see. Uh. Okay. So if I put you like this, you'll fall, and you're you'll fall. Then, if I pull this out, you'll fall, and I'll put that back. Yes, yes, yes. And then, let's go! Woo! Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> Crank handle, where's your disco? Oh, we did it! <laughs> my, my brain is firing at all neurons. <laughs> Surprise, motherfucker! Oh yeah, surprise motherfucker indeed. Alright, nothing in here. Ooh, what's this? A storybook mom bought me. Oh. So he was sleeping under the like 50 moons? I did that was your neuron saying that, yeah! <laughs> he woke up. He's lost, maybe. He's like, hey, have you seen all the- oh! Oh, his family! Is that your family? <laughs> look! They look like moons! <laughs> it's all coming back to bugs, you're right! Alright, so, he's sleeping. His family's like, okay, peace. He wakes up, they all gone. He's like, oh, have you seen- Oh, Fi, they're gonna be gone by Monday. You don't have a lot of time, Fi. You don't have a lot of time. You only have this weekend. <laughs> have you seen my 40 to 50 wild moons? Why do you think I've been demo streaming all week? <laughs> it hasn't been for my health, I'll tell you that. Uh, you don't know where all the moons are. You don't know where all the moons are. You don't know where all the moons are. I think this is me. I think he's talking to me. Because that's definitely my fashion. Such is life indeed. Uh, I'm sad. Where'd they go? Okay, that's not my family. That's just the stars. Oh, it makes me energized. And I'm like, they'll see me. That's my dad. He's like, oh, there he is. That's my mom. Oh, thank goodness. <laughs> You're right. He is constipated. That's the baby going. How can I fly? All right, that's it. The end. What a good storybook. Dear day. Happy birthday. It's stars are nature's laxative. <laughs> if you pay attention, you'll find that the world is full of surprises. Guess what I've got you. You've always wanted this. 
The birthday card I got when I was nine. I got my dream gift that year. Okay. He's older than nine. There are some letters on the lock of the bookcase. Buddy, I don't know what this is. Okay, we'll come back to it. <laughs> I, too, am older than nine. I feel like I've seen this shape somewhere. Oh, god damn it. Okay, back to the storybook. Um... Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, so we got it. Fuck, um, I gotta write this down. Uh... One, two, three... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. No. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so we got eight. And then we got three. Then we got one. And then we got one, two, three, four, five, six, six. Okay. All right, I got it. I don't, I thought it was just four. Oh, now I gotta look again. Hold on. Oh. Yeah, so showed up here. That's eight. That's three. That's one. Oh! You're right, it is missing a page. That's kinda wild. Hmm. Okay. We're gonna have to find that page. Okay, so there's something else before the six. Okay, I got it. Alright. You're tired, so you're hanging out here. I gotta tell you right now, it's a really good place and time to hang out. Because this is a very chill game. Welcome to the hangouts, indeed potted plant that is still alive and thriving. Uh, I can't get into this yet. I don't think so, anyway. My old TV. It really is more of a memento. A precious map for my travel with mom. That's cute. A blurry old photo. Uh, let's see. The good wolf. Oh, hello. An album for my photography practice. It's been a while since I last took a photo seriously. I wish I had my monsty pal in real life. If only. Oh, okay, I get it, I get it. Hmm. Let me look on this for... What's the word? Um, clues. Oh! A torn- wait, where did I put it? A torn page from the storybook. A grim claw tigrix called Mr. Grimms. I don't quite understand, but that's cool. Uh, let's see here. Nope. What? What does that mean? Oh, Monster Hunter. Okay, okay. Oh! Your shirt's upside down! Ah! Oh, ah, oh, you fool! Okay. So it's not a- it's not a one. It's a one, two, three, four, it's a five! Got it. This snake is me more and more. <laughs> 
I too put my clothes on upside down or inside out or something like that. Okay. So, eight. Three. Five. Six. Yeah, let's go! Origami flowers. A gift I made for Mother's Day. This is the day where mom and I, when mom and I went to see the meteor shower. Photos and souvenirs from my trips. That's a lot of trips. Hope I'll get to hold a photography exhibition one day. Um. Can I open this? Nope, doesn't seem like it. Okay. Uh, we're going over here. Don't worry, I got the crank. I'm here. This is really cute. <laughs> oh! Hello! A wooden boy doll. He's looking a bit lonely on the... Uh, wooden horse. I feel like I've seen this before. I want to capture this scene, but how? This looks like- OH! Okay, I guess I need everything first. trophy for a photo contest. Uh, I don't think there's anything else in here. Oh, there we go. Yeah, that's it from here. Okay. Let's see. This old boy's gotta go somewhere, I guess. Wait, oh! Here we are. Yeah, a dollhouse. The house seems to be missing something. The sun! Thank you. I should put it up somewhere. Uh, let's see. I think I have a spot for it right over here. Yeah, here we go. Now the wall is full of memories. The shapes look symbolic. Oh, hold on! I don't see all the shapes, actually. I just see this. world in a globe. Okay, let me think on that one. Uh... Because I have this one down here. I think the shapes are from there. Oh! Northeast. Okay, hold on. No, I don't get it. Uh, let's see. Could there be something on the back? No. Hmm. Hmm. Let's see. I think that's very important, but I can't figure out why. Oh, wait, hold on, hold on. Is this... Okay. Uh. Hmm. I understand. It sounds like it's the morning, and the sun rises in the east. Correct? Rises in the east, and it sets in the west. So. 
Diamond. Oh, yeah, I know this game. Uh, what remains of Edith Fitch? I think it's either on my list somewhere or I have it. I have to double check. Oh, okay, okay. Um, so diamond. Uh, diamond in the north. Uh, that thing in the east. I can't really explain it, but I'll know it when I see it again. Um, downward triangle in the south. And star in the west. Let's try that. Whew! Man, that was scary. Okay. Uh, well, not scary, but, um my brain okay so diamond uh, it's like this shape in the west it's this shape and in the south it's that did that work no hmm but I know these are the shapes So, what if this is the north? So what if this one's the north? And that's the east. And the west is the downward triangle. And the south is this shape. How's that? Nope. Okay. So what if this is the north? And then east of that is the star. And west of that is this. And then south of that is the diamond. Nope. Okay. So what if east is the diamond? Um west is this. South is that. And north is this. Y'all help me out. <laughs> like Ah, uh, no, the globe won't help me. Hmm. Something's got to indicate a direction to me. I thought this would be east because... the sunlight's coming through, but I don't know that. I don't know that anymore. Um, yeah, it could be afternoon, so maybe this is the west? So maybe this is the north? Okay, uh, let's see. Okay. So west is this, and north is this, and south is this, and east is this. Is that right? That doesn't seem to be right either. Okay, uh... That's not it. Whew! This one is... 
This one is a toughie. Um, what if it's like this and this? Um, I believe so. Like, that's a diamond with the bottom bit. That's that weird star thing. Uh, that's a downwards triangle. And that's a star. I can't think of what other symbol might be in this direction other than that. Yeah. Yeah, because that's why I had to put this one up. Yeah, it's just the direction is fucking me up. Um... Yeah, the two stars are opposite each other. Oh, okay, that was it. <laughs> um, alright. I think I have everything I need. Wait, come on! I need to- I need to put the- I got the curtains! No, there's one more thing I have to open. I gotta open this. The dry cabinet is locked. There's a camera and some stuff inside. Man, I don't know. I don't know. Let's try... Let's try that number I picked up before. Nope. Okay. Alright. Where do I find numbers in this bitch? Let's see. Oh, hold on. So, there's a seven there. That's actually the only number that's out. Yeah, okay. Uh, let's see, let's see. What can I look at? Uh, this says five over twenty. Uh, oh, hold on. Why I gotta, why I gotta do math? I didn't put on a calculator. I pulled out my clock. Uh, okay, let's try that. Let's try. I got a few things to try. Uh, first I have two, zero, eight. Three, and then I got zero, two, zero, eight. Neither of them. Alright, what else I got? Um, Don't worry. Maybe it's in here. I don't think so, though. I don't think I saw any numbers in here. Mm. 
Try six three one nine. Let's try six one three nine just in case. Nope. Okay. chest. Souvenirs from your trip. Five, one, two, four. Let's try that. Y'all got any ideas? What a happy family. Birthday? My birthday? Is... Is, is this my birthday? <laughs> Maybe it's zero five. Hmm. Yeah. A point for Skurb! Oh my god. <laughs> I couldn't use this. <laughs> Man. Maybe I'll try to get familiar with the camera mom gave me again. I struggle with safe daily. <laughs> yeah, this is where I'm gonna take the picture. Thank you. This looks like the photo mom sent me, but it's lacking something. Oh, buddy, don't fucking worry. I got it all. I got it. There we go. I can make this look like mom's train window photo. Can I really take a better shot? There you go. Yeah, we got the props. Let's go. Oh, my God. Ooh. We did it! It doesn't really look like mom's photo. Ugh, what am I missing? Is it the angle? Yeah, it's the fucking angle. Okay. Um. 
I'm not really sure what to do about that. Can I move this over? Yes! Okay. Oh, I think I got it. To the person next door watching. There we go. Woo! I've always believed that seeing it gives it reality. If you see something and experience it as beautiful, there is beauty. An imitation of mom's photo on the train window. The red curtains of flowers make a good contrast against the greenery outside. This is what she saw. Today, a letter addressed to me. Feel every moment of life with your heart. It looks so good, I can almost smell it. Dear Day, the camera I gave you is the best I've ever had. It has to be that good to match your talent. I'm now in a big bustling city. When I take a break from work, I often come to this cafe to sit by the windows and watch people passing by. With your talents of capturing beauty, what photos you could take here? I always believe that seeing it gives it reality. If you see something and experience it as beautiful, there is beauty. But more importantly, the food's amazing here. I hope to share this with you one day. Where is this train going? Oh, it's okay, there's no one here. Oh. Day. Are you still with me? You trauma? You trauma in? Very intense. Oh, to be continued. So this is the star named Aos. <laughs> you traumaing son? <laughs> this is a really nice looking game. Man, I definitely want to try it out when it comes out. I'm clicking to leave. Yeah, it does look really cool. Okay, let me let me wish list this for I forget actually. Let me switch to my BRB screen. Did I actually switch? I did. I switched the category that time. Woo! Good job, me. Okay. We got one more demo today. And then we will break until tomorrow. Um, so we are going to be trying out Mineko's Night Market. I've been following this fucking Twitter for a long time. And somehow I missed all of their things that were like, Oh, we're going to be in the Steam Next Fest. So yesterday I was like, Oh, fuck, I need to add them. So that's what I'm doing today. Um, so, Mineko's Night Market is a narrative-driven, social simulation adventure game that celebrates Japanese culture while encouraging players to craft, eat, and ultimately enjoy all of the cats. So let me open that up. Yeah! Cats! My favorite! Eat! My favorite! craft i'm okay with it all right here it is let me pin it i love craft i love eat i love pussy <laughs> oh mineko's night market you gotta respond you can do it buddy i believe in you oh it's not responding give it a sec Oh, it's been, it's been on your wish list too. Let's go. Let's go. I had to close some stuff. Okay, let's close that and that and that. Oh, thank God. It made it through. Um, does this use controller? No. All right. Does it, does it use controller? <laughs> let's switch over. And here we go. Oh, it does use controller. Hell yeah. Okay. And it started at this volume. I love that for me. And you can remap the controls. I don't know if I need to do that yet. I don't know if I need to do that yet. Hold on. Hold on. Okay. It won't let me, uh... It won't let me change, though. Okay, so Mineko's needs PS input. Mineko PS input. 
I swear, all these devs are gonna get so mad at me because I'm like, I need input for my PlayStation controller. They're probably like, buddy, just fucking pick up an Xbox controller. I have one, I just don't want to use it. Welcome to the craft store. Oh, it's you, the new girl in town. Mineko, I believe. Uh, yep, that's me. Yay, I'm going to remember you. My name is Bobo's mom. <laughs> that's what, that's what every kid hears. <laughs> it's, <laughs> is that your real name? It is. Lucky for me, I ended up having a child named Bobo. <laughs> this is so funny. Speaking of whom, Bobo told me you died out in the woods. But I can see that you are not dead. Which is much better when you think about it. Hmm, let me show you something. Why don't you go and take that flower craft bench? I'm a little short on money at the moment. Oh, I meant you could have it as a gift. She's trying to keep you busy so you don't go and almost die again. Bobo! <laughs> Bobo, nobody dies. Anywho, I bought that flower craft bench for my daughter Saki, but she had developed other interests. Yeah, a keen interest in going out late with her friends. Bobo! Bobo's just a, ra a wisecracking kid. Anywho, I'll have the flower craft bench delivered to your house immediately. I saw you just moved into the old house on the western side. Yeah, now we can all stop wondering if everyone ever will move into that weird side of town again. Haha. <laughs> Bobo! There's nothing weird about that side or people that live on that side of the island. <laughs> That's how lesbians do. In fact, before you two were born, there were plenty of families that lived there. You know, back when there were actual jobs at the market to look forward to. Where did everyone go? Most people left the island to look for work. But a handful of residents stayed because we just couldn't bear to leave this place. We call those people suckas, Bobo. <laughs> Bobo. <laughs> Thank you, Mineko. Anywho, go and check out your new flower craft bench at home when you have a moment. I'd be very excited to see what you make with it. Thank you, er, Bobo's mom. I, I love that. <laughs> as soon as I was like, is that her real name? To <laughs> the game, is that her real name? Wait, 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 wait. I gotta go back in. I gotta see if I can pet that cat. Hold on, hold on. Glad you didn't die, new kid. I don't want to talk to you. I want to talk to your cat. What about this one? They have two black cats? And a- Yo! How many cats they got? How this cat get up there? <laughs> so many! Hey you! Are you into bugs too? Or do you think they're gross? Uh... I like bugs. You don't gotta be brave around me. I bet you think they're gross. Aw oh man, you gotta try Beetle Brand Ramen. Don't be scared, it's just a brand name and does not include actual beetles. Wait, I gotta try Beetle Brand Ramen first. Okay. Yeah, I love bugs. I know, beetles in the game. I can't believe it. Beetle Brand Ramen. You here for my autograph? Hook <laughs> yuck. I'm gonna be a famous ball player like Speedo Ageru someday. You may doubt me now, but I never said I doubted you. So you think I could be a professional baseball player? Sure. Whoa! This is huge! I need to train hard for my pro career. Someone get me two sports drinks. Stat! Stat means fast, I think. It's like BTT brand. Beetle Soup Ramen brand. <laughs> See you at the night market on Saturday nights. Do you listen to boys? Dollar sign? Uh, boys? Boys! The hottest band to ever exist. Which one is your favorite? Mine is Show. I called him. Oh, no, wait. It's Coco. Ah, I can't choose. Don't make me. Oh man. They make a boys drink now. I need a soda pop star. No, I need three soda pop stars. One for each boys boy. <laughs> Man, everyone's real comfortable asking me to get them stuff. I just got here. 
Hey, I like your style. You should be on my show sometime. You got it. Wicked. I mean, I don't have a show now. But when I do, you should be on it. I really want to start a show all about food. If you want to help me get this thing off the ground, come talk to me. We're going to be superstars. The first thing we need to make is content. I guess if we want to make a show about food, we'll need food. Oh, let's start with a cup of truffle ramen. That should be easy to find in a vending machine around here. Hey, new dude. You into any games? I love games, but there's nothing to do around here. People seem to be into these boximal things lately. You ever seen them? I want to get into boximals, but they're so expensive. If you have an extra boximal blind box, I'd really want to try opening one. Okay. Ooh, a flower. You discovered the plum flower. Cute. Uh, I guess I live in this house? Yo, this house is falling apart. I live like this? Oh, hey, Dad. Hey, wor- That's cute. What a cute nickname. Wormburger. Hey, Wormburger. Looks like you got a delivery in your room. How cute. Man, what is going on in this cartoon show? Is this my room? This is the kitchen. Oh, hold on. Oh, baseball. Yeah, luxury living. This is such a big box. Nifty. Find four sakura flowers and three plum flowers to craft a craft bouquet. A cat bouquet. I think this is the only outfit I have, yeah. Hmm, I think I'll sleep later. Alright, good to know though that I could probably wear different outfits. Going flower picking little toot? Sounds fun. Flowers grow every day, so if you run out, just go to sleep and try again tomorrow. Hey, maybe you're lucky and it'll rain soon. Flowers love growing in the rain. Weirdos. Dad, why are you so cute? Uh-oh. Here comes trouble with a capital T. Oh my god. You're so nerdy. I love you. <laughs> what a good dad. <laughs> He's every amount of bad dad jokes. Ooh. I discovered the sakura flower. I had to talk to these kids. Hold on. Oh, hey. Are you that new kid that's looking for Abe? You have me mistaken. Never mind. I think Abe is overrated anyways. I mean, Abe is okay, but there are way more interesting folktales than the story of Abe. Me? I'm way into crypto. N Nico? That's short for cryptozoology. I'm gonna catalog all the mysterious creatures or the yokai of this island. How many have you found so far? None. I I'm gonna need a place to gather all my yokai hunting evidence. Let me know if you find a spare yokai face zipper pouch around here. Aye! Oh! You scared me with your new face! Not that your face is scary, I just wasn't expecting to see a new combination of, spa of facial features. Is it Abe or Abe? It's probably Abe. Anyway, what's your deal? Like, mine is dogs. Everyone knows me as the kid that likes dogs. What's your thing? Uh, cats? Nah, but we'll find something for you, kid. You're still young yet. Oh, wait. You're that kid that fell off that bridge and almost died. That's your thing. I don't think... No, no, no. That was rad. You showed you got guts. A dog-like fight in your heart. Come talk to me if you ever want to do any tradsies. Aw, oh, man. I just saw a commercial for something called Pug Ramune. I never heard about it until now. I guess I gotta get that for you. Why do I have a heart, a heart meter that's going down? Uh, what's my collection look like? Yeah, bridge kid. What does original language mean? As opposed to what? Okay. Um, I guess when they localize it. I don't know how many flowers I have. I guess not enough. Ooh, 
Looks like I have enough flowers to craft a cat bouquet on my flower craft bench. So I really like the feel of this game. It's like, hey, you can craft and you can, you know, play with cats and shit. But it's like on a smaller scale than like Stardew Valley and stuff is. And I appreciate that. Because, I mean, I'm not gonna lie, Stardew Valley is kind of overwhelming for me at times. <laughs> Yeah, like a DS game. Cap okay. Enter the- hit enter when the arrow's in the green area. Okay. I messed up. Oh, I got it? Okay. Yay, I made a cap okay. I should show this cap okay to that nice lady, Bobo's mom, at the craft store. Did I actually- do I have it? Okay, cool. Hey, Dad. What new quirky thing are you gonna say now? Hey, two butt. Have you made me rich yet? Ha <laughs> ha. Uh oh. Here comes trouble with the capital T. Thanks, Dad. I appreciate it. Money made this week. Okay. <laughs> Thank you, Dad.exe. <laughs> oh flower. I am running low on health. If I'm not careful, I'm gonna collapse from picking up all these... There's a cat there. Hey, buddy, are you good? Hey, cat, are you okay over there? Meow. Yes, in cat. <laughs> I didn't know I could speak cat. Sorry, we're still awaiting our next shipment of... <gasps> Mineko! You're always welcome here. Were you ever able to figure out how to use that flower craft bench? If you ever make anything with it, I'd love to see. Gift one cat bouquet to Bobo's mom. Hold on, can I pet the cat now? Guys, I can't pet the cat. Oh my god. I hope I can pet the cat later. Oh, I need truffle ramen. And Ramune drink. And soda pop star. I didn't buy anything. Oh, have you had a chance to try making a cat bouquet yet? Did you make this? Wow, you're a natural at this. I can't wait to see what else you make. You know what? You should really be selling this at the night market every Saturday night. Heck, I would buy more of these from you if you sold them there. Especially since we are friends now. Hee <laughs> hee. I suppose it might be difficult to make more crafts with so few flowers that grow in our village. People used to go out to the gardens to pick flowers. But of course, with the agency investigating throughout the island, bus to travel to most areas of the island are restricted right now. Investigating what? You're right. I gotta go Saturday, Saturday, Saturday night. <laughs> uh, agency? I'm sure you've seen those mysterious folks in suits poking around here and there. You can't tell who they are because nobody... You can tell who they are because nobody wears suits out here. Hee <laughs> hee. Unfortunately, they secured the entire area of the gardens. Pay for the seat, but you'll only need the edge. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> Such a shame. I hope they're open again soon. We used to visit there every summer. Oh, since you're a natural at this, let me teach you another recipe. I learned the Kokedama recipe. And keep talking and gifting things to various people. You never know what someone can teach you. Thank you so much for stopping by, Mineko. Find a way to get into the gardens. Hold on, can I buy shit? Can I buy this? Uh, actually... Should I buy the truffle ramen? I thought it was a very particular Ramune drink. I think it was a very particular Ramune drink. Um, I'll buy the truffle ramen though. Yo! Yo, Minex! Can I call you Minex? It's shorter and cooler. It's literally the same number of letters as Mineko. But it ain't cooler. Anyway, we gotta find a way to get to the gardens. I didn't know you had such an enthusiasm for flowers. Forget flowers, it's been another sighting of him. Hold on, again with the him. Who the heck are you talking about? Abe! It's Abe! Abe? Yes, Abe! I couldn't say it any greener. <laughs> Did you ever read the story of Abe before? It's like the oldest story ever. 
course I have, but what the heck are you talking about? Abe is a character from a book. That's what they want you to think. They? Those creepy agents, they're behind this, I know it. There have been Abe sightings here and there around the island for years. But lately, the sightings have been more frequent. Everyone's got their own Abe sighting story now. And now, just by coincidence, these agents begin popping up? Well, you don't gotta be a genius to figure out something smells fishy here. But thankfully, I'm a genius. I skipped grade one. Anyway, there are agents all over the gardens, and I gotta see what they're guarding. If you attempt to enter the gardens, I'm coming with. Take the bus to the gardens. <laughs> Abe of the woods. Hold on. I gotta give this truffle ramen to this girl. Hey! Awesome! We are so filming the uncoupled uncupping of this noodle. Oh, here's something for you. I learned the box flowers recipe for the flower craft bench. You know, we can't just go live with a video of noodles. We need a little more. Oh, how about something sweet? A chocolate box. If you can grab one of those from the night market, that'd be, well, sweet. Alright. Uh, we're going on the bus. We're going to the gardens. Every part of this game look- Oh no, a sneaking mission! Oh no! I didn't think I'd see a sneaking mission! Ah, they've surrounded the place. We gotta find a way in somehow. Uh, is it just me, or do you notice those agents seem to have captured cats in cages? Yeah, it's the men in black! What the heck? That's where all the cats are going! Cats are going missing? Yeah, this island used to be full of cats, but recently they've just been vanishing. Like, around the time those agents started appearing? Yeah, I swear all this junk is connected. Hmm, I might know someone who knows someone who knows something about this. Dude, I'm gonna do some interrogating back home. You gotta free those cats, Manex. I thought we were gonna? Are you chickening out on me? No, not even a teensy bit. Being the brains of this operation is work too. I'll catch you at home. I believe in you, Min uh, Minex. <laughs> okay, Bobo. Or... Bobs? Bobs? Oh, it's Bobo. Not Bobs. Yo, that bus came real fucking quick. Thanks, Bobs. Liberate those captured cats. Keep out of the agent's flashlights. If you get caught three times, you'll have to start over. Oh, TNR program too extreme. <laughs> Keep out of our business. Oh, I didn't know that counted. Can I just start over? Hold on, let me start over. <laughs> Do I have to save? I don't think so. <gasps> I love that I have five love with my dad. He's my dad, but still. Yeah, I'm just gonna, yeah. That's fine. Yeah, let me start over. That's fine. Alright, I gotta wait for your buddy to get here. Yeah, see, so I'll start talking. <laughs> oh man, I just watched that video the other day. Da 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 da. You're my dad! Oogie woogie woogie. <laughs> uh, let's see, let's see. Um. Hey, buddy, what are you doing? Uh oh, uh oh. Turn back around. Oh, I get it. I get it. Okay. Okay. Kittens! Oh, thank you for the head pets, too. Yeah, turn around. Turn around, bitch. Turn around. Here we go. 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 You're free. You're free. Get out of here. You Get out of here. Oh, fuck. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Woo! I'm okay. <gasps> Yay! Level up! Good job, Tiger. Good job, you guys. We leveled up Tiger.
Y'all not care about hard rock? Oh, maybe I need them to go to sleep. Yeah, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Let's go, buddy. You're free! Hmm. What are y'all doing? Oh, I see. Hmm. Okay, do it again. Do it again. Let me see what I'm working with here. Okay, okay, okay. I'm picking it up. Okay, one more. Just gonna walk in here. Oh, fuck, fuck, fuck. I'm okay, I'm okay. I'm okay, somehow. Somehow I'm okay. Oh, that's okay. That's good, that's good. I'm okay with that. To be fair, I was pretty good. Oh, hey, is this your sports drink? I'm taking it. Looks like this agent is using this tree trunk as his desk. I love how your eye bobbles when you walk. Yeah, it's really cute. Hmm. Hmm. There's a suspicious looking agent in that tea house. I better free the rest of the cats before I deal with that. Okay. Well, can I do something about it? Yeah, I can't go up there yet. That's fine. Let's go this way. Uh, hmm. Hmm, doesn't seem like there's anything over here. Okay. Let's go back this way then. Oh, okay, okay. What do you do? What do you do? Do you just walk back and forth? Oh, oh, okay, okay. Go, 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 Mineko, go, Mineko, go. Woo! Oh, I got you, I got you. You're free! Alright. I'm waiting for this guy to walk around. through let's go through oh 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 I see I see ah uh, uh, okay what am I supposed to do about this guy I think I can. I think I could just change it. Maybe I have to wait? Maybe he gets thirsty? Kill! <laughs> yeah... Wondering if I can. Oh, Ooh, okay. That's fine. So right now these fuckers are sleeping. How y'all feel about that?
No, that only works on them. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know what to do for this. Can't, like, run into it or knock it off. set something down. I don't think so. Like on its table? Oh, I didn't even know I could like fucking you know, sneak. No, that doesn't discard on the table. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not sure about this one, y'all. What if I wait around the corner? That's what I was thinking, too. I was thinking, what if I waited? like here or over here like maybe you have to be idle for a certain amount of time and he's like oh I'm fucking thirsty it almost looks like there's a path to the other to another to the other side of the kitty. Um I tell you what, I can't figure it out though. Uh I'll try below in a sec. I don't think so though, because it was very specific about where I could and couldn't go. Yeah, I like can't go past this area here. And if I try to go this way, it won't let me go. I'll just try idling here for a minute. See if he walks away. So how's it going, guys? How's your Saturday? Hope you've been having a good one. you're in my coolest discord you'll see the fan art that recently that I got commissioned that was recently done I'm very I have a lot of feelings around it it's very good I want to cry yeah I did a really good job I saw just now. Yeah, I would have posted it, but they were like, can I post this on social media? And I was like, absolutely. Less work for me to do. Oh my God, what do I need to do for you guy? What do I need to do? How do I- oh. 
Sorry. There we go. Forgot how to stop. Can I just run into you? Oh. I know, I know he's using it at his desk. What does that mean? Alright, I only got one life left. I'm not sure what to do. Hmm. Take a shit on his desk. No! Hold on, this is why I have, um... This is why I have to have steam. Uh, yeah, the guy that never looks away. You'll have to find something around the garden that you can use to distract him with. Like what? Okay. I was stumped at that agent too until I stumbled on a tiny corner of the top right of the flashlight's cone where you can stand and release the cat without getting caught. I did that because the game really doesn't give you any key any clues about what might be used. I... I agree. I agree. It just... It doesn't give you anything. Um... Hmm. Let's see what someone else has to say about it. Uh... Oh wow, this game's been in... This game's been in development since 2017. Yeah, let's see. Let's see if I can... Yo! Yo, they're right! It works! <laughs> it should be safe to examine the tea house now. How? How am I supposed to examine the tea house? Me? Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, there's something else. There's something else I gotta examine. Oh, I just went right next to that guy. That was scary. Yeah, he's just like, this is fine. The power has been cut from the tea house. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Fuck. Oh. No, that's okay. I'm good. Woo! Okay. Because I'm no longer looking for cats, I'm good. It's fine. Don't worry about it. What is this? I found an artifact. What the fuck is this? Ah, we're wasting our time here. Let's roll out. Yeah, I was going to suggest we roll out. I was already in the process of rolling out before you said. Let's go. <gasps> Ow, fuck. Going. Ow. Hey, what's up? Huh? What can you eat? Uh, I can eat now. I just have this, but this is my last one. Do okay. you want me to warm up your food now? Ow! Can we also have vegetables? Is that okay? Sure. Mm. The agents have left the village garden. Whew, you can now use this location to collect flowers. Cats have returned to the area. Yes, you can pet them. <laughs> Dude, that was rice balls. You got rid of them all. Everything's working out. Heck yeah, most things are working out. Most. My ex, I've been crunching the numbers. The deeper we get into the deeper we get into this mess, the more it seems we're gonna need some money. You know, I know I'm gonna be making us the money, right? Hey, you're the one with the night market booth. Keep on crafting and finding stuff to sell at Saturday. Saturday, Saturday, Saturday night's market. It'd be a huge help to our biz. Oh, did you know you can spell sell any spare flowers and junk at my mom's craft store too? Now go make us that coin, Manex. And what will you be doing? Hey, being the face of this company is a job too. Peace outies. Blah, blah. Yes. Yeah, look at that. Look at that fucking, look at that pet animation. Look at it. 
They just flop after. I love them. I think I'm running low on uh, health. What happens when I run out? Let's find out. Five years well spent. Yeah! Yeah. I like the way they purr. Oh! I think this guy's following me. Look! Look! But you're keeping, you're keeping your distance. I get it. Yeah, let's go! Oh no, you got stuck! Hold on, come here! Come here! I'm very happy about this cat. Alright, come here, come here. I'm not gonna get you stuck again. Let's go, let's go. Yeah, let's pet this one. Woo! Can I take this? Oh, why can't I take it? <laughs> Thank you! Oh! Hi! What is this? The white hairball. Oh! Hey cat, you didn't tell me I could pick up hairballs. Why do I want them? The gray hairball. The black hairball. Alright, come on. Come on, my little cute, cute buddy. Yeah, I'm getting the cat eggs. <laughs> Ooh, flower. Let's go, buddy. Oh! Another one. I hope it's a ball of hair and not an actual hairball. Me too. I'm too tired to even pick a flower. Alright, it's time for me to go home. Can I still pet you? I'm not tired enough to give you pats. Let's go. Oh, I can still pick up hairballs, though. That's good. That's good to know. Oh. Oh! A black cat! Let's go, let's go, let's go! Hi! Oh my god. Oh my god. They're both following me. I love you. I love you. I must go. I have to go to sleep. I'm sorry. Y'all gonna follow me home? Y'all get on the bus with me. That's chill. Okay, y'all getting on the bus? Oh, that's the demo. I want this game so bad. That's the demo, y'all. This is Mineko's Night Market. I'm really looking forward to it. It's... I thought it was already on my wish list, but it's going on my wish list. It's coming out... Soon. Yo, look at this! Why that big-ass cat following us? I want to meet it. Okay. Let me go to our just chatting. Thanks for hanging out with me today, guys. I really appreciate it. We played a lot of games. That made our tomorrow a lot easier. We have eight demos to go. Can you believe it? We started with over 30 demos and now we're down to eight. Oh my God. Okay, tomorrow I'm gonna start at noon, probably. Um, and we're gonna slam through those demos. I wanna be done. <laughs> I'm looking forward to it. Um, we'll have everything else that's on my list. Yeah. Uh, and if you need my list, again, here it is. So you can see what we've gone through, where we're going, and uh, all that fun stuff. 
So thanks for hanging out with me today. Uh, it's Black History Month. I'm black 365 days of the year, but February I'm even blacker. And I like to uh, pass on that love of blackness to... Um... I've been raiding black people this week. This month. This whole month. That's what it is. Um, so, we're gonna find someone to raid. Please stick around for the raid if you can. Um, we are going to raid... Uh, do y'all want to watch some Muse Dash? I think y'all want to watch some Muse Dash. Um, yeah, we're going to raid to Q, the dreamer. I Hold on. Let me double check. I'm like 90% sure. I just gotta wait for their ads to go through. Anyway, I really appreciate you guys hanging out. I really appreciate it a lot. Please make sure to drink water and to eat food and um, to hang out because you know, just chill, it's the weekend. Enjoy yourself. Um, let's get the raid set up. Oh, hold on, hold on. If, if you are a subscriber, here's your raid message. And if you are not a subscriber, here's your raid message. Thanks for hanging out with me today. Let's send some love. Yeah, hanging out with friends. All right, let me go to my offline screen. Also, thank you for the pats. Oh, <laughs> I switched over right in time. All right, let's give some love. <laughs> 